そうそこいる Lua sip, we thirsty Lua sip. Ah, I, I brushed Boo earlier today. He needs a he needs a haircut. I cut his hair a little bit, you know, but but he needs more haircut. No, thank you so much. Thank you. Isn't he so cute? Okay. You guys better start praising Boo. Bunnies are so cute. Hey, hey. <laughs> but why are you looking that praise be the bunny overlord lord and savior of the fluffs okay <clears throat> we'll let him sleep i need the other boo Anything on this grid, right? the card packs do you guys want to open the Baldur's Gate 3 collector's edition before we start with the game itself yeah because I want to see the dice yeah let's do that because we forgot okay let me
over it. Oh, I love it. I love how bright the sun is. Oh, fancy souls. <clears throat> Candice, thank you, thank you. Hello, hello. We will remove the condom from the box. Do we need some? We will find some. Hey! Sarah! Thank you so, so much for the two months of support, Sarah. Thank you. Mark! So. Thank you so much for the two months. Find your face, find your face, find your face, find your face. Let me, let me make it bigger. Need love. Thank you. Thank you so much for your subscription. Thank you. Oh, I made a better for you. Hold on. Let me make this a little bit better. So you guys can see it better. Yeah, the early access has been around for, for a little bit. Yeah, I know there's two of me. One is for you guys, you see the box. Okay, so this is... I actually wonder what's the, the other one. The certificate on the other one. This is... 1,600... Better? Is this... Is this better? Okay. We could go to the character creation. I feel like the music is quiet right now. No, the cutscene will play. Ah, it's fine. Just for the music. Who are you? I'm your mom. Okay. <laughs> uh, Paranomic. I regretted not getting the collector's edition uh, for Divinity Original Sin 2 for so many years. Soon as they announced, soon as they announced the collector's edition of Baldur's Gate 3, I got it. And I ended up getting two. <laughs> so, uh, should we, should we? Check just the certificate of that one to see what number that is. I'm really curious. Maybe we should. No. Nah. 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 We we'll, we'll do this some other time. Uh. Okay. Do you guys want to see everything again, really fast? It should be fast, so let's 
let me show you. Uh, okay. So. Here, it's the certificate of authenticity. It's too bright. It's the sun. Does anyone know how I turn off the sun? Change our title so we open this. Let me see if this is better. Hmm, still too bright. nothing I can do about it yeah I can't change the side oh you guys can see you, you see it's it's actually there's a texture and everything That we would be opening this on stream. <laughs> okay, so it also came with stickers. Which one is your favorite? Which is your favorite sticker? I love Gale. Because the, the, the Gale sunglasses look so cute. Minsk looks a little bit sad. I don't know. Lazo is so cute. I also love the, the emperor. The middle one. G uh, Will. Will is lovely. Will is lovely. <laughs> and there is more serious stickers. Angry shirt. Wait! Oh, there's another set of stickers. Oh my god! Look! It's the, the classes. So, whichever class is your favorite? Oh, thank you, Mim. Cool. Okay. Okay, this one I cannot show you guys. Because it's so cute. It's... It's so cute. It's gonna give you a heart attack. Are you guys ready? Okay, I'll show. But you need to be ready. Not ready? Okay. I respect. No ready. It's okay. You need to be prepared for this. You take the risk? Oh my goodness! Luwei Jam. 
Thank you, thank, thank you. You died? Oh, so you weren't ready. Oh, is this so cute? Boo is the cutest. By far. Thank you, Steak. Thank you. It's us. Yeah, isn't it so cute? Ah, oh, the little dragon. Oh, those are so cute. I love Boo. Boo. Boo wins. <laughs> those are stickers from the collector's edition. Now. <clears throat> uh, those are the character sheets. This is Gil. Find your face. Find your face. Find your face. Thank you, Chu. Thank you so much for your prime subscription. Thank you. Thank you. And stink. Mwah. Thank you for the three months. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. Gil. So you, you get to see his skills. You get to see everything. Wow. The fences. He's missing his hand. Oh, you can see his other hand. Um, it, it's paper, but it's... It's... It's the best paper ever. Yeah, so we can actually open it. And here we have a page where we can see his cantrips, his spells. Here you can see his equipment, his wizard features. His attunement. Nice. And there's also the back. And in the back, you can see his backstory. Tara, the Tresu, is far more than Gil's pet. She has been his only advisor and friend since he was brought low by the orb. Tease him. Uh, wait. W what's that? Can't read. Seize him, brought she might. Tara will do everything she can to keep Gil safe. Just don't say she's a cat. She's definitely a cat, though. And then there is this his backstory. Do you guys want me to 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 read? So the backstory of Gil. What? What's a god to a world-class wizard? Gil was once a formidable archmage in Waterdeep, but pushed his relationship with the goddess Mistra too far. Not satisfied with being her lover, Gil tried to impress her further and meddled with powers beyond even his abilities. His attempt leaving him Cursed with an orb of Nedery's magic trapped inside his body, cataclysmic power of the orb has turned Gale into a weapon capable of annihilating an entire city. Should he fall, should he fail to control himself, wrecked with shame for his hubris, Gale retreated to his tower. First, out of self-pity, and then out of necessity. His research led him to a means of keeping the orb's power contained, but only temporarily. Now, with the threat of seromorphosis looming large, can Gale see both of the green fates lurking within him, or, or is he doomed at every turn? Yep. Oh, there is also his personality traits. And ideals and everything? Hold on. Gil uses his intelligence as shield for navigating most areas of his life. 
It's funny because he should be using wisdom or something, right? But he clearly doesn't. <laughs> um, leaving behind the isolation of his ivory tower, Gale's no longer hitting from no longer hiding from the world, but ready to embrace it. There is nothing better than gaining knowledge than first-hand experience. I mean, we can... Is Boo out? Yeah, Boo is out. <laughs> He's coming back. Although Gale once counted Mistra as a lover, his folly in tampering with Nethery's, Mali uh, N Nethery's magic has left their relationship seemingly in ashes. In attempting, attempting to go closer to the goddess, Gil only succeeded in pushing her away. This reminds me, once I had an ex-boyfriend that he said that I was like a bucket of water. The more that he tried to hug me, the more that the water went away. Huh. Oh well. Um. That was in high school. Flaws. Time has passed since Gail's ambition drove him. He has been forced to learn humility. <coughs> what? Where? When? <laughs> but when he next faces temptation, will he have the strength to resist? He, he, he didn't learn any of it, though. Oh well, let's move on. Hey, Camis. Boo? Hey. Boo. Boo was very close to this. Imagine if he tried eating that. That would have been bad. <laughs> Ooh! Basil! Ah! Uh, this is gorgeous. This music. Ah. Okay. So here is her character sheet. She only has one spell that's a cantrip Mage Hand. It checks. And her equipment is this. Yeah? Nice equipment. She has. Features, fighter features, and traits. That's basically... Oh, you know what we forgot to do? Hold on. Let's see... With Gale, his introduction. If it's similar to what we just saw. Well met, stranger. You find yourself in the presence of the renowned wizarding prodigy, Gale of Waterdeep. Please, no need to be intimidated. Here, My he's an archmage. My once caught the eye of the goddess of magic herself, Mistra, who named me her chosen and her lover. Okay, Gale, we That's get it, you fucked. calculation on my part, that relationship eventually soured, as did the greatest of my powers. Now I'm merely a humble wizard on the road to redemption. Unless I can find the path to something greater. Greater than redemption? Like what? God, he's so cocky. I'm sorry, I'm trying to make sure that my bunny does not eat the collector's edition. I know it shouldn't be such a 
hard task, but turns out it really is. This works. Uh, can you see his little ears? Can you see the, the little beast? He's like, a, I want the collector's edition. <laughs> okay. Now we we pass Gale. Now let's do Basil. Oh, uh, he he's drinking water. Uh Okay. A bit. Oh, 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 oh. Basil? Are, are her stats right? They are! Look, 17 strength, 13 dex. That's actually exactly right. Ah, hey, Hellas. <laughs> oh, she has 8 charisma? Yep. Cool. Intellect is wrong? Intelligence. Oh yeah, she has more intelligence. <laughs> yep. It's okay. It's okay. Um, we saw this. This is the back. I'll just read everything for you guys. So it's easier for both of us. <clears throat> Beza should have 13 now. That's I, I, I agree with you. Okay. Uh, allies and organizations. Every Githyanki swears their life in the service of the bitch queen. Sorry. Lich queen Vlaketh. Vlaketh's mission to conquer the cosmos leaves no room for allies outside the Githyanki people. And makes them subject to fear and hatred across the plains. If Lazo can track down an outpost of her own people, they and their fabled red dragons are experts in fighting against mind flayers. Personality traits. While Lazo is determined to solve her problems as, efficient, as efficiently as possible, she increasingly finds her curiosity sparked by the new world she's in. Ideals. Lazo believes in the power of her own sword arm to strike first and strike last. Relationships that go beyond fractalities are seen as frivolities in gift Yankee society. They, there is service to Vlacket and Little else. And flaws. Ruthless and unforgiving, Lazo is often stubbornly unwilling to try a plan she doesn't already know is going to work from her own experiences. And uh, her backstory. <clears throat> uh, I don't know what's this first... Can, can you guys tell me what is this first letter? I just don't get it. What? What's the first word? Crashed? Thank you. Thank you. Crashed down to the sword coast from the stars. Lazos is a Lazo is a fierce warrior, even by the standards of militant Gifyanki society. She was the first of his crash. Uh, somebody wrote about that on Reddit. When forced with the possibility of becoming a mind flayer, the monster she has dis dedicated her life to defeating, she must prove her worth and earn the right to rejoin her people if they don't execute her first. Will Lazo's strength and determination be enough to prove herself to, qu to bitch queen, lich queen Vlakev? Or must she walk another path in exile? What do you have to say for yourself, Basil?
Since I was born in the cold reaches of wild space, I have known but one purpose. To wield a silver sword and ride a red dragon in service of my regent, the Githyanki Queen Vlakith. My first step on this path is to slay a Mind Flayer and bring its head to my queen. There is no flesh I will not carve, and no barrier I will not shatter to see it done. I am the one who sunders. I am the Undying Queen's most unshakable warrior. I am Lazelle of Kalir. No, I, I actually bought this collector's edition as soon as they announced it, a year ago. And they were actually selling this collector's edition for six months. This collector's edition only sold out when they showed bare sex on the panel from hell. Oh, Shadowheart is next. Okay. So, uh, can we check her stats? This is your job. Because I can't see both. Are her stats right? Wait. Not even close? Wow. It's okay. I look like a... <laughs> Thank you. Uh... <clears throat> so, uh, let me show you guys first. The entire page. Cool. Now we open. She should have Firebolt as cantrip. Guidance. Resistance. Wait, where is Firebolt? Doesn't she have Fireball? Huh! Well, thanks to her Fireball... Thanks to her fireball, it's a ratio. It's a ratio cantrip. It should be listed. I said fireboat, not fireball. I never said fireball. Yeah. I used her fireboat to do that super epic uh, green kill. Yeah, yeah. I'm talking about fireboat. She, she has a cantrip, fireboat. It's not listed here. Okay. It's likely that they sent this to be made very early on because it took them a while. Because they made 25,000 of these. Okay. Now we'll be checking the back page. So they probably had to make adjustments to the characters and balancing. And they couldn't adjust with them. I think they did change ratios. Okay. <clears throat> Shadowheart, by name of spell, her order have placed upon her, remembers but blurry specters of her Sharon allies. She must report back to her mother superior. She must... The leader of an order who has taught her everything she knows. Or at least, that's left she knows <clears throat> personality traits super hot goth girlfriend i always wanted another oh wait that's not uh, hold on personality is a luxury sharon's who regular regularly must travel the uh, clear-minded without it uh the odd things slips through her favorite animals are mice 
a favorite animal? Is mice? Boo, my friend! I think you got the chance! Squeak! Nice! Well, hamsters, I assume. I assume she also likes hamsters. Yeah. <clears throat> she finds herself humming songs that she never heard before. Oh, shit. That's actually really interesting. Because music... Uh, does play around with your memory like that, right? <clears throat> Shadowheart would not have been trusted with her mission were she not a rising star in her order. Trained for leadership, she pressures herself to excel in her cult. That's her ideal. Bonds, the sworn enemy of her people, are the dreamy Selunites, worshippers of the moon goddess, and she will cut them without question. Flaws, practical, practical and patient, Shadowheart will never want to enter a battle she doesn't know she can win, and is challenged when she must trust her instincts. Yeah, because I mean, what's left of her instincts? She lost her memory. She... Eh, stop. Backstory. A devoted cleric of Shar, goddess of darkness and loss, Shadowheart agreed to have her memories wiped as part of a holy mission. Now its sole survivor, she must deliver a powerful relic to her kin in order to win Shar's love and have her memories restored. But all the while, She's tormented by strange, painful magic that she struggles to understand. You know what's funny? Uh, the artifact is now listed as her equipment. Or items. Yeah. But she, she carries 10 candles. Yeah, it's hidden. She's probably she probably hid it in her underwear, right? And not in her backpack. Right? <sighs> yep. Oh, let's see what she has to say for herself. You need to guard him. Oh no no no. One. Wrong button. My name is Shadowheart, loyal servant of Shah, goddess of darkness and loss. There is little more I can tell you than that. My lady Shah tasked me with a mission of such secrecy that I surrendered great swathes of my memory in order to safeguard the knowledge of it. That's so! All I know is that I must bring the artifact I hold to Baldur's Gate, and that nothing can stand in my way. My goddess is watching we haven't decided yet triple stamp so we're just doing the collector's edition my favorite character can i answer this one after we go through them okay the next one is gusterian cool are his stats right Yup. Really? Wow, this is the first one. Cool. He has a cantrip, Mineral Illusion, which he doesn't. He actually has Fire Boat as well. He has equipment, this guy's kit. Okay. Uh, and... Let's read his backstory. I'll try to be quicker, but we went halfway already, so... <clears throat> Asterion has not had a union with another that lasted longer than one night in centuries. So all the people in love with Asterion... Sorry, it's one night and then ditch. 
which means you're probably dead. And can hardly imagine one coming his way anytime soon. His fate remains linked, however, to the six other vampire spawn of Cazador's Coven and Baldur's Gate. Cazador's family, scared and marked as a stare in one. Justin, thank you so much! Enjoy! Enjoy! Thank you! Thank you! Enjoy your bunny mugs! I drew them myself with lots of love! Thank you so much for the support! Thanks to that, I can afford blackjack and hookers for my bunny. <laughs> <laughs> Asterion <laughs> drips. Job. Hey, Brit Brittany, thank you for the two months. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you. <clears throat> Personality. Thank you so much, Brittany. Thank you. Asterion drips with charm be before everyone he meets. How much of it is an act? Even himself isn't sure anymore. Ideals. Freedom almost states finer than blood. A staring will do everything he can to secure it. Bonds. Day walking or not, a staring is only one step ahead of his master Cazador, as long as he remain but a vampire spawn. While he has boiled seduction down to a fine art, and can quickly win over almost anyone. Keeping and trusting a newfound ally is another challenge altogether. Asterion prowled the night as a vampire spawn for centuries, forced to follow the orders of his sadist master, Cazador. Seduce, seduce every fool with a pulse and lure them back to my lair. Free for now, he would do anything to keep his life in the light. He can see but one way to ensure his liberty for good, become many times more powerful than his old abuser ever could dream of being. His body is forever tainted by the intricate patterned scaring of Cazador carved upon his back, and the elder vampire seems set on sending waves of hunters seeking to capture his lost spawn. This is gorgeous. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, let's see what he has to say. Yeah, I mean... It's easy for you to love him. But if he will love you back, that's another story. Darling, Hello. don't be shy. I promise not to bite until we've been formally introduced. <laughs> My name's Astarian, and I've spent a century stalking the night, hunting for pretty morsels just like you. A man called Cazador made me what I am, kept me like a pet, forced me to do his bidding. No more. The Tapel's influence broke his dominance over me, and now I can finally pursue the one thing I've hungered for these long, dark years. Revenge. I'm going back to Baldur's Gate to track Cazador down in his lair. I'll be the last thing the bastard ever sees. <laughs> <laughs> Where is the boo introduction cinematic? <laughs> okay, the next one will be Will and then Karlak. Okay, so Will... Let's check his stats. Are they right? I can't see. Nope. Ah. Oh well. <clears throat> Will holds 
immeasurable respect for his father, Duke Uther Ravengard. Hey, Gil! Thank you so much for the two months of support. Mwah, may the abundance be with you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. Especially my bunny. Uh, he, he loves the blackjack and hookers that you guys support for him. <laughs> Personality... Wait. Will is keen to prove himself a hero to his father again. Though he has been long away, his name is still known throughout the Flaming Fist. Consular Floric of Baldur's Gate watched Will grow up and feels as a tragedy that one of her oldest friends and his son have become so estranged. While Will begrudges Mizora's help, Will does believe that her power has helped him do far more good than he would have been able to do without her help. He, simp he simply doubts that that can last. Personality traits. The very picture of selflessness. Will has never put himself before anyone in his life. Even in his very part was a personal sacrifice that made him to bring others out of peril. Ideals. Will always tries hard to see the world in his best light, but life isn't often the fairy tale he dreams to be. Bonds. Will is enchanted to be unable to speak freely of his pact with others. His tongue bound by Mizor, its true nature is sealed with the Cambion alone. I feel like Mizor was a Cambion still, she's a devil now. They upgraded her. Flaws. The existence of the pact is a secret to all but Will's angered father. If it were to be known by those who look at him as a hero, he fears no living soul would trust him again. Baxter. From a scion of famed Baldurian house, to a life of adventure on the road. Will's life as the monster hunter called the Blade of Frontiers has made him one of the one of the beating hearts of the Sword Coast. While he has done great deeds for the coast people, the source of his power remains a secret. The Cambian devil, Mizora, drew Will into a warlock's pact in a moment with many lives at stake and cursed him with the duty of hunting her enemies. Mizora only asks Will to sacrifice devilish creatures to her, but the Camion's ambitions are ever fickle, and Will wishes to escape her the pact before its price grows corrupt. And uh, this is the back. Pretty cool. Now let's see what he said. Seven years ago, I was exiled from Baldur's Gate, the city I call home. My name is Will, but the people of the Sword Coast call me the Blade of Frontiers, champion of the meek, defender of the innocent. The truth isn't quite so simple. This is the last one. But they're right about one thing. I hunt monsters, and I always catch my prey. My latest target is a devil. And I'm right on her tail. Once I'm through with her, she'll never escape the fires of the first hell. Okay. And now the last one. Carla. Are her stats right? Nope. It's okay. 
fresh escaped from hell, Carlex is finally free of the arch de archdevil Zerio, but not from the inferno engine Zerio planted in her chest. With her first taste of freedom in 10 years, Carlax is eager to find a fix for the engine that's burning hotter and hotter before it burns her out completely. But even more, premier in her mind, exploring, finding like-minded travelers, falling in love or lust, and taking revenge on the men who sold her to Zerio all those years ago. Carlax hasn't lived in a long time, and she feels she has a lot of catching up to do. Any experience, any sensation, any connection she can have will mean everything to her. Carlax is overwhelmed by her good feature at every turn. She had given up living on but now finds old scars might heal after all. The archdevil Zerio still values Karlak as one of her prized inventions, and the engine in her body is a miraculous feat of engineering. Her own mechanical heart is what allows Karlak to turn any battle into a raft's inferno, but she burned herself up with no regard for her own life. Oh, here. The old boss you worked for back in Baldur's Gate might have changed a lot in the last decade, but Karlak is sure he will still be up to the same, same old sins. She swears she put him through worse than hell. Hell is, isn't done with Karlak yet. Ever since reaching the material plane, she's found the engine in her body is behaving strangely. She wishes to make an ally of Inferno Mechanic who can dial who can dial, but Zeria won't let her favorite soldier go easily. She sends scouts and hunters in search of her errant tiefling in hopes of bringing her back in one piece, or two, if needed. Awesome. Awesome. And now, there is the map. upside down <laughs> it's upside down too it's fine just flip your monitors I know I know okay we're done with everything here Okay, Flippy. I feel like my favorite was that sticker page, which is so cute. Gosh, it's so hot. Let me put... I know, it's really cool. And hold it uh, if you guys have the digital edition of the game, ooh. if you guys have the digital, uh, digital deluxe edition, you will get a PDF of this book. So we will not go through the book because you you guys can already and most of you probably have the PDF version. So this book is basically that but printed. It's absolutely gorgeous though. Yeah, so you can see everything that's in this book. And now What is this? Hmm. 
There's Lacken. Oh! I got a tadpole! Wait. Come on, camera. If you inserted this into somebody's brain and I suck it, they would definitely die. <sighs> yeah. Yep. <sighs> Hold on, I'll put this over. And. Uh... Wow, this is heavy. Whoa! Huh! It's a metallic D20. It's so heavy. You could actually kill somebody with this. If you get a roll you don't want, if you throw it into somebody's head, they die. It's huge. No, this is a D20. Cool. It's gorgeous. Gosh. <laughs> DM, give me a reroll or else you get the dice, dice to the face. Okay. I will show you guys the statue and then we'll play the game. Deal? <laughs> that would break your table and roll? Yep. Let's put this back. Back and back. We will open the packs. Just one second. Whee! Let me get uh, the statue. Hold on. Okay. this uh, let's put the, the box condom on the box I think the draw represents Tav. 
Some people were thinking it was um, dressed. Give away? Nope. That one is gonna go for my dad. Did they sell that book on its own? I don't think so. You can get the PDF version. Sell it? Never. Are you guys crazy? I love Baldur's Gate. Okay, we'll open these packs, okay? And then we'll start the game. Or just be suffering here for way too long. Give me one second. Th those packs. Are Okay, so those packs, they came with the collector's edition. Let's open. Ha! Huh. Okay. Backwards? You guys, one of my collector's edition I got as a gift from Larian. And the other one I bought, I bought uh, a while back. Okay. You guys will see the cards before I do, okay? Hold on. Hold on. Oh. Hold on. Let me... Okay, we'll go in order. Hold on. And... Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! It's Boon Minsk! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh wait! That's not the fr That's... Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mountain. Diamond. Nice. Psychic. Yeah, those magic cards, they come with the collector's edition. They come with the packs. Nice. Oh, Kaga! Oh my gosh, we got Kaga! I have shaking hands, you guys. Oh my god! Yep. 
Oh, a gloom stalker. Sharpshooter elf. Safana. That's very pretty. No, I do not play Magic the Gathering. But this is a... Do packs usually have this many cards? <laughs> wow. I, I remember opening a few... Oh, wait! Oh! It's actually shiny, this one. I couldn't see because it was on the camera. Cool. Yeah, this is foil. Sorry, I forgot the word. Cool. Awesome. Okay. We have two more packs. Hold on. Two more. Draft have 15? I don't know. It's just that the last pack that I opened felt a lot smaller than this. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Island. Ethercap. There's our set boosters. Oh, I see. Sky Diamond. Stone Speaker Crystal. Corco Diamond. So many gems. Sky Diamond. Marble Diamond. Limberite Schematic. Bone Color Cleric. Those cards, they come with the Collector's Edition. That's why we're opening those packs. Sarah Vok! Oh my god! Cool! Hey, Indy Fish, thank you so, so much for, for nine months. And Shady Business, thank you so, so much for, for your raid. Guy Bog, thank you so much for the two months. Thank you. <gasps> Karlak! Awesome! That's awesome! She's expensive? Okay. Hold on. Val. Oh! Illited Harvester. Very pretty one. Mind flares are just so sexy. Aren't they? Summon undead? Wait. That looks like a kid summoning an undead. Oh my god. Oh, it's foil! It's foil! Hey, Carnage, thank you! It's a very cute necromancer. I'm gonna shoot cute. Yeah, this is just the back. Cool! Hold on. I'm just keeping them in order. Okay. Our next... This is our last pack. Hold on.
You guys, you know how my, my hands are shaky, right? When I worked as a model, once I had to do a jewelry catwalk. Yeah, nobody could see the jewels in my hands. Nobody. So... <laughs> so I never picked those again. Come on. Ooh! Is that the Starion? That's awesome! Mountain? Goggles of the night. Ooh, the butcher. Different butcher, but... Fresh meat. My God. Come on. Here we go. Shiny in patches. Prophetic pr prism, wafers bubble, spill the spoils, bag of holding. Oh, I need one of these in real life. Stone speaker crystal, mind stone, Abdel A Adrian Gorian's ward. What? Is this Baldur's Gate 2 and 1 again? Awesome. Agent of the Shadow Thieves. I actually love... I love... I don't understand magic the game, but I love the cards have characters I know. <gasps> Basil! We got Karlak and Lazel. <gasps> oh my god, we got Jahira? Rustbite. Oh my gosh. This is beautiful. Oh my god. Is it foil? It is. It's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I can touch this. Nice. Well, the devil, you guys saw. It's just a token. <laughs> yeah, those cards, they came with the collector's edition. So, I thought we might want to open them. Ah, <sighs> I was hoping for some Minsk and Boo, you know, but... No man's gonna boo for me. It's okay. I have the real boo. And the bunny boo. You guys, look at him. He just flopped. He's Lee. No Mintara. No Mintara. Easily. Give me one second, okay? I'll just put those in a safe place and not in front of me. Mantara? Oh, I love We didn't we didn't see her intro, right? I did unbox the dice and the dice is right here. Come on. It's so heavy.
It's so heavy. If you don't like your row, you can throw this dice at somebody and kill them. Bah! Seriously, this is... This is heavy. Well... I know... Uh, my hands are not that tiny. It's a huge, heavy dice. Would it be funny to see a row? I think I need to roll on the floor. Okay, I'll roll the dice, okay? Wish me luck. I'm telling you, you can kill somebody with this. <laughs> you heard how heavy it is. This, I'm telling you, you could kill somebody with this. You don't like your role, you throw at the DM, you threaten to throw at the DM. And like, DM, change my role right now, or I change you. Bah! I know. <laughs> it can make a dent. DM down, game over. <laughs> yeah, bro, I rolled a 20. DM, this is a 20. If you don't think it is, I will make sure you see it from real close. <laughs> This is made of pure metal. Ten years ago, I was sold to the Archdevil Zariel. She put a hellfire engine in my chest and made me her prized soldier. But I've escaped now. Thank you, Mind Flayers. And I've got a few scores to settle. If this engine doesn't burn me to ash first, I'll need people I can trust. An infernal mechanic and a serious amount of luck. But you know what? I'm not worried. After 10 years in the Hells, I can take on anything. I've got my chance at freedom. And believe me, I'm going home. She's nice. She's the horniest character. Does Carlac count as a unicorn? He's me. <laughs> okay. There was no character sheet for Dark Urge, but let's see his intro. Because I love the voice. I love the, the voice actor. My rancid blood whispers to me. Kill, kill, and kill again. My ruined body yearns to reap death in this world. And when this foul urge calls, it possesses my whole being. Injured beyond repair. I know nothing besides this. I must resist the dark urge, lest it consume my mind. I must discover who I was and what happened to me before my twitching knife hand writes a tragedy in blood. God, I love... Like, you can hear his feelings so well. Right? It's so good. The symbol under his feet? Okay. Okay. 
So here's the thing. I have a few ideas that we could do for runs. Um, I have the strong suspicion that there will be a big update for Baldur's Gate soon. Because I've heard from people in chat that some voice actors were sent back to record. But it, it doesn't matter. It, if an update hits as we are playing, we just deal with this when it's a problem. I don't know. I don't know. Some people were saying that they were recording. I don't know. I don't know. Some people in chat. I didn't hear this from anyone uh, important. <laughs> Unless if it was somebody important on a Twitch account, I don't know. <laughs> but... You know, we didn't have a patch in a while. <laughs> well, you guys are important, but I mean, important like s somebody that I know that would know something, you know? Because if somebody I know that would know something, I would probably not be telling you guys. Sorry. I've signed a bunch of NDAs in my life. <laughs> I don't know how long they cover. <laughs> oh yeah, you guys know a lot. I mean, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's only for PC. No, this game is also on PlayStation and it's coming for Xbox soon. Here are the ideas. I was thinking of doing a wild magic run, but I kind of wanted to have a mod. A mod that applied wild magic to everything. Like, anything you do in the game, like attacking or anything, has a 20% chance to cause wild magic. But I couldn't find any mods like that. I basically found a bunch of dress-up mods, and I was like... Nope, it's fine. So, if I ever can find somebody that could make some challenge mods like this, it would be really nice. Yeah. No, 100% chance I feel like it's too much because it would get old really fast. Yeah, it's... I feel like 20% would be good. Uh, if any of you guys know how to mod Baldur's Gate, reach out to me. Maybe... maybe... maybe I can commission you to, to make some mods that we can... could do something like that. Would be fun. Thank you. Um... Uh, so, no mods. Let's put the wild magic in the box for now. Okay? Soon as I get somebody that could make this mod, then we try that. Also... Also... If you can make Baldur's Gate 3 mods, just, just message me. On Discord. Um, if you don't, don't message me. Don't. <laughs> Thank you. If you guys want to chat, you can join Discord, the talkie talkie. I love chatting there. I'm always chatting there. But, but I, I, it's just that I had a weird incident with private messages, so I, I, I don't like just chatting on DMs. Uh, it's a long story. It's a long story. Yeah, I, I, I'm just very friendly. So I started chatting with this person and then one day life got really busy and they were like, I'm sorry, but now you need to make appointments to chat with me. So they wanted to make like appointments every Thursday, 5 p.m. I had to spend one hour of my day to chat with them. And that's when I decided to not chat with people in DMs ever again. So I'm more than happy to talk, but in talkie talkie. So we all talk together. Much more fun. Yeah, that's why I, I don't like chatting in DMs. <laughs> I know. Um, so, no small talk in DMs, but we can have small talks in Discord, talkie talk. I will, I will kill myself with this dice. 
<laughs> there's lots of good people on Twitch. But there are some, some weird people. It's the internet, right? Okay. So. I was thinking about doing another solo run. But one that I have sex with Gil. I don't know how I could do that, but I'll figure that out. We... I was thinking... I could go as a druid. A moon druid. So we transform into animals and I cosplay. So we would cosplay as a bear first. Okay, so... Because we never really played much with Druid. Hey boo. You wanna cosplay as a bear too? a bear run <laughs> no I'm not a furry I'm just a druid wow <laughs> okay um and the other one <laughs> And, uh, you know, and nothing against anyone's, you know, business. Buddy Chalulu, thank you. Thank you so much for the 16 months. I'm pretty sure we can make it work. So we can get a druid to to either be as a, a bear and I will cosplay as a bear and then we just hopefully we can bear the entire game. Uh. And the other idea would be um an assassin druid that will basically try to finish every fight in one turn. In the first turn. Well, I don't know if it's possible. That's why it would be fun to try. <laughs> you know? I don't know. You guys, do, do you guys think I planned the Grimford fight? If it was possible? No! But we tried and it worked. I meant, I sorry, I meant Ranger. Sorry, not Druid. Sorry, my... For some reason, in my head, Druid and Ranger are the same thing. I don't know why. Just... I meant uh, an assassin ranger. I mean, a ranger with a pet bear? I guess we can adopt Halsen. If he's up to it. Yeah, it would be a gloom. But we would try to do everything in one turn. Yeah. Assassin Ranger. But again, I feel like it would be fun to try to do everything in one turn. Somehow. What do you guys think? I never played any of those builds before. So it would be fun to go to together. No, no, I, I, I don't use barrels in my... I don't use barrels in my challenge runs. 
On my first playthrough, I blew up the entire game and it was great. So, we'll only be using game mechanics. No barrels. I feel like barrels... Barrels just cheese too, too hard. No, no, I love barrels. But again, it... it if I allow myself to use barrels, I, I would just... Every fight will be an explosion. It's just not gonna be fun. You know? I, we're not playing as a barrel man soon. Yeah. So, what do you guys prefer? Since those are two different builds, we can start as one, eh? If we don't like it, we can change to the other. Or you guys want to make a poll? Cool girls, don't look at explosions. We could do an assassin run, right? I feel like an assassin, a solo assassin would be fun. Okay, there is just one thing though. Yeah, and thank you so, so much for the two months. Mm. If we do a solo play again... Are you guys okay if I get Carlac's head? So I don't feel so lonely. Yeah, please. But please? Please. I just really like her. Thank you. Maybe if we play as Dark Origin, we might be able to get a hand from Gale as well. <laughs> oh, fancy. Oh, sweet. <laughs> yeah, we could collect body parts! Right? Ozzy, thank you so much for the five sub gifts. Mm, made the bunnies boo with you. What about the clown? Well, we'll collect the clown. Do you guys want to kill everyone? You guys... I actually wanted to try to get Alfira to survive. I played this game... This is, this, will, this is going to be my fourth playthrough and I never seen Alfira survive. Oh no, of course. I, I'll make sure that all the animals survive and are happy. Of course. Okay. The other option is... Instead of playing as Dark Urge... We could play as an Origin character we didn't play yet. Except Karlak, because... She's gonna be with us anyways. <laughs> Nah, let's just play Dark Urge. We could also try to go for the evil Dark Urge. I played Dark Urge on my first playthrough, but I was good. I was really good. It was really nice. But maybe it's time to be bad. I'm gonna have Karlac even bad. She's gonna be in my inventory.
Hey, Regan, how are you doing? Did you have a good day? Okay. We don't have to be a lizard. How about we play as a halfling? Because they're very OP. Huh? A gnome! Gnome! Gnome is the OP one, right? Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Gnome. Yeah, we'll play as a gnome. How about we try to make something very strong? Yeah, we'll play as a gnome. Okay. A deep gnome? Because we also have advantage on stealth checks. We can play... We'll start as a ranger. So we play as an assassin. Okay. Uh, favorite enemy? Uh, we played as a Gifyanki last time. I, I want to play as a different race. <laughs> Too deep for you? It's okay. You know, the deep gnome will be singing Evanescence late at night in the camp. What is that song that everyone that learns the guitar knows how to play? Come on. Wonderwall! Yeah, we're gonna be playing Wonderwall in the camp every night. Let's go! We have a plan! <laughs> Favorite enemy. Bounty Hunter? Proficiency in Investigation? Ooh, and we can find the familiar. Creatures you hit? Ooh. Proficiency in Arcana? Wait a second! If you guys wanna be fucking strong... We should play as a Starion. Right? Because he can ascend! He can ascend! Oh no, you, you don't want me to play as a Siren because you want me to have sex with him. Okay, fine. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll have sex with a Starion instead. Okay. Okay, that's fair. Okay. Mage Breaker. The idea is we're gonna assassin everybody. We'll try to do everything in one turn. Solo. Try. Carlac murder robo. Hmm. Ranger and knight. You have sworn. No, no, if we want to be strong as possible, we need to be either be a Sterian or a Gnome. Hold on, I didn't make my character yet. Uh, I'm just picking what they might be. Yeah, Gnomes are really good. Gnomes are the strongest race because they have advantage on intelligence, wisdom, charisma, saving trolls, and. Also in stealth checks. Ranger Knight. Oh, we gain armor proficiency. And then we gain skill proficiency? Yeah, I think we'll go as Ranger... Uh... Ranger Knight. Okay. I 
I won't be using heavy armor though. Eh, it's okay. I mean, we can always respec, right? If there's a, a little minor problem. Uh, ears. B stamina. Yeah, some some magic items are heavy. Like no, no, the helm of the Baldurin is major. B stamer. Urban Tracker Wasteland Wanderer Resistance to Fire would be good. Urban we can steal from people. Yeah, you're right. Why resist fire if you kill in one turn? That's a good point. Hmm. Okay, so... I'm between uh, urban, but we could have a familiar. You know what I wish? I wish we could talk with familiars. Let's go with urban so we can steal from people. Last playthrough, I couldn't steal from anybody and it traumatized me. I love stealing. Uh, hounded on one. Sure. Um. Our stats. We never need any strength. <laughs> no, no, I need a break from... I need a break from scary games. Like, real life has been real hard on me. I... I... I the reason why I'm playing Baldur's Gate right now, it's because I need something that I really love and something that calms me down. And I just really love murdering everybody in this game. And getting Carlac's head in my inventory and playing around with her and there is nothing that brings me more comfort. I need this. If you're upset, I'll throw this dice at you. So don't be upset. Velto, thank you. Ooh. Enjoy your bunny amounts. Thank you. Thank you so much. Frick. We will... We'll still go... Don't, don't get me wrong. We'll still play scary aliens, okay? We'll still play... I also want to play Spider-Man. You guys remember how my PlayStation blew up yesterday on stream while we were playing Spider-Man? I figured out why. After three hours after stream. It was film grain. If The moment that I disabled film grain, my, my PlayStation 5 started blowing up. The moment I enabled film grain again, everything worked just fine. But it's still, I had just so much stress recently that I wanted to play something that that calms me down. So we'll play Spider-Man again, we'll play Alien again, but we will also play Baldur's Gate. Because that's what I want. Okay. In my most stressful days, we'll calm here. It's okay. It's okay. Honestly, it was kind of nice that the PlayStation 5 blew up because we got some marshmallows and, you know. Uh. Okay, stats. Think. Do we even need con? If the idea is kill everything in the first run, <laughs> we're not going to get hit, right? Yeah. But I don't think we'll be like killing people in one go when they start. We will need to build our strength.
I think this is the best I can... Zero Charisma? We could use our level up to gain one Dex and one Con. That's good, right? We get two stats. Hmm. I feel like this is pretty good. The only problem is this. Oh, and also the our character. <sighs> okay. Yeah, the charisma is too low. Might need to change those stats. This big girl. Ah, oh, she's pretty. Look at that. Uh. Where to next? What was that? Let's hope the locals are friendly. Hells. Something just woke up down here. Be wary. This place is trapped. It's opened. This I one. wonder what's back there. This one. Can we get her more purple? Ah, oh, this is cute. Okay. Scar? Nah, we'll be giving scars to other people. Instead. Hmm. That's cute. Uh... There's only one vulva? No, there is two vulvas and four penises. What the hell? I know. Hold on. Do you put... I don't understand why games only allow you to have face tattoos. I just assume a lot of game devs have face tattoos. It's, it's the only logical thing I can... Right? Or maybe they really want you to have face tattoos. I get that you're invisible. But, but... What if I want... A cute tattoo in my ass that I only see when I'm having a sex scene? Why can't I have that? Why can't I have a cute little bunny in my ass that I can only see when I'm bare ass? What's the problem? How's that wrong? In your ass, no. Oh, come on, on my ass. Come on, English is not my native language. I'll dice you guys. Hey ho, hoots. I don't think there's a different time. It's always weird time here. Is there any? Is there any that we can actually use? Eh, nah. Well, I like the flower in the neck. Yeah, we'll go with the flower in the neck. Sure. Nah, no piercings. Please, no dice. I love heterochromia. Oh. Uh, you see, Rijun? I, I knew you had a ton of face tattoos. Yeah, of course. You're you're dev, so Oh, the purple eyes. Yes. But I think I would not use a terracomi, even though I love it. We can go for two purples. Oh, that's so nice. 
Oh, I love this. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's change this hair because this hair is awful. You're gonna make the strongest and the sexiest gnome around. We can change the hair later, right? Okay, uh, no highlights. Hold on. Let's gray our hair a little bit. Because I think it's really nice. And then we can gray it in purple. Nice kit. I think that hair that we had was, was actually the best. We are doing ranger. We are going to be an assassin. You just never see it coming. Uh oh. You see? Oh, this is cute. We can have like some piggy tails. We'll be the cutest assassin around. No. I like this face. I know that her jaw is too strong for that hair. But I don't think there's any other face that... That's cute. Yeah. Can we change out this now? I think this is more gnomish, right? I wonder... <laughs> I wonder how the sex scenes will go. Maybe that's why they didn't give us a dwarf companion. Like Yan. I love Yan. If Yan was in this game, I could romance him. I would have romanced him in, in the first one. Though. It's okay. I think this is the best. I think she looks really cute like this. Yes, Rande. We are. Oh, we didn't watch the cutscene. She's really cute. This looks like my hair? No, not at all. My hair is like a mess that I just threw up because it was really, really hot. Do we go male gnome? I never played as a male character. Yeah, she's cute. She's really cute. No, no, she's cute. Okay. We have a problem here. Our charisma. Oh, 
Kalia. Thank you so much for the two months. Thank you. Yennefer of the Underdark. Hey. Aren't I just gonna kill everybody? But sometimes I can convince people to kill themselves. I do need wisdom. Hmm. Hey, Marco, how are you doing? Let's check our skills. Stop. <laughs> I will stop playing with this dice. Hold on. Survival, perception. Oh, we need insight. Uh. This is good, right? What we can do... Is make those... Like this... And do this. We could also reduce wisdom a little bit. For this. We need too many stats. Yeah, if we are assassinating, do we need this much Kana? The problem is this, right? Twelve should be enough. I I I can't max anything. The the highest stat I can have is seventeen or sixteen. I think twelve is fine. Yeah, this should be good. We're so cute. Yeah, I, I can't. I could do... Nah, this is better. The dad can talk. Okay. Yeah, when we get to the hag and all this, we, we can restart later. Name. Twelve is what you have in real life? Manshak, that means our character is not getting laid. It's okay. Darth... Darth Urge. Min Tower. Mini Tower! Reindeer, you're a genius. It's 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 beautiful. Yeah, mini tar. It's like mintar but mini. Oh, did we set the background? Right. Hold on. Oh, we, we have... We are playing as Dark Urge. No, no, Mini... Mini Tower, you know Min Tower, but Mini? Mm. 
Wait, are we starts right? Yeah. Yep. That was a good idea. I'm going to be whatever I feel like. I don't know. I'll try to keep Alfira alive. But I want you to watch the cutscene. We didn't watch the cutscene. Mintara has red eyes, right? Doesn't she? And black hair, deep red. We already have black. She has white hair. We can change this later too, right? That doesn't look like me at all! She has like a blonde, right? Oh man... When I think of Mintara, I just imagine her sitting on my face and... And that doesn't include her hair color. I think it's more like this. Thanks, Google. Nah, it's fine. I, I like this hair. Got the origin hair mod. Oh. That's actually a good idea. Maybe after stream. Shrek. We're making Shrek. How do I make Shrek? How? Oh, here. Okay. Shrek. Eyes. General. Green. Do you guys know? This is a good shack, shack grain. A Grinch gift Yankee? Why not human shrek? Can you make human shrek well? Shrek has brown eyes, right? I don't remember Shrek's hairstyle. Oh, right. Um. Yeah, the music is amazing. The first time. The first time ever. 
that I got you Baldur's Gate free, correct or creator? It was during their early access, soon as they released their early access. And that was the first time this game made me cry. For some reason, I was just so excited to play this game in the early access. That I just couldn't handle it. And I just started crying. If you guys dig real deep in my YouTube, you might find it. I think we're done. I'll need to skip so we watch the entire cutscene. I just need to save the correct. Because we didn't watch the beginning. I can't start a playthrough without the cutscene. It's wrong. But we'll watch this. Aww, we're already bloody. Maybe we had our period? The blood in your head thrums and pounds. That pounding blood obscures who you are. An overwhelming loss of memory. How you ended up amidst these hellish flames is just as hidden. You have nothing in your skull. Besides your name and a headache. I have nothing in my skull and my dumb? In danger. I'm in danger. Wait, is this working? <gasps> yeah, basically how I wake up most days. Who did this to me? The torturer behind this cruel prank will meet your malice when you get out of here. Oh. Killing. Now that sounds like your first good idea. <laughs> okay, cool. We save. Oh, my head. Damn you, Lord Farquaad. Twitch plays Baldur's Gate. I did that on early access. I'd rather when we discuss things. Maybe at one point. Hold on, just so we watch the cutscene. I, I need to see it. Or it doesn't feel like we started the, the game. Grab your cockporns. I mean, popcorns. Oh. He float. She moan. I think that's the emperor. I think that's Lazel. I think that's the emperor's sperm. I need to cut those nails. It's our turn. You guys open it real big. Open it real big. Yep. Awesome. Okay, let's go. Imagine we just created our character. Bye, Mr. Emperor. He's... Oh. He's so much bigger than the other guy. Jump, 
Okay, thank you. For the seven months. BG Louis. Oh yeah, uh, this is... Uh, imagine this for the Minotaur. Gosh... Uh, I... I... I feel... I find that that trailer is just perfect. It's just so good. I've been watching that trailer for... a while. And it's just... I just love it. <laughs> you look at cheesecake the way I look at Baldur's Gate 3. Thrums and pounds, I and hate cheesecake. Who you are. An overwhelming loss of memory. <laughs> How you ended up amidst these hellish flames is just as hidden. You have nothing in your skull. Besides I don't your like name cheesecake. and a headache. But you are in danger. I'm in danger. <laughs> It's just that I like cakes that are simple. You know those cakes your grandmother makes that is basically just simple cakes, you know? And she's cakes that there's too much to them. I, I, I like simple cakes. Just simple cakes with no much sugar and things like that, you know? I just like a good cake. 
It doesn't even need to be chocolate. It can be like anything, like carrot, chocolate, but, but like simple, not too much to it, you know? Just, just cake. I know, cheesecake is wrong, Pooh. Like, that's what I have been saying. The torturer behind this cruel prank will meet your malice when you get out of here. <laughs> Killing. Now that sounds like your first good idea. <laughs> Need to find a way. Ugh. My head. Ah. Look. Considering the emperor's sperms were right here, does this make this nursery the emperor's balls? Do you guys think it's the right or the left ball? Oh wait, mind flares don't work like I I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The sound of my character stepping on those fleshy bits is just nice. It's like ASMR. Open up. Hey! This is my ex-boyfriend! I wonder if I can finally have sex with every goblin in the goblin camp. I hope so. I to ask. <laughs> yes, you've come to save us from this place. From this place, you'll free us. The exposed brain quivers in expectation. So cute, please. Before they return, they return. Um, you sound afraid. Why? Oh, yeah, I need a new title, right? Can we even do the tutorial solo? I don't think so. I think we are forced with Basil, right? It's okay. We st the run officially starts after the tutorial. You sound afraid. Why? The enemy. So many enemies. A minotaur. I think you're past the point of saving. Tell me what to do. Remove us from this body. From this case. Free us. Please. Oof. I think Dax, to, uh, Dax is our biggest chance. Oh, the sacrifice. You thank you so much for gifting us love to Handles. Oh, gummy bear. Thank you. That's so kind of you. Mm. Wait, you gifted the cheer tree, Sabo? Oh gosh, that's so kind of you. Thank you. Now, I'm not going to kill us. I have no... Good! Really good! The brain lifts from the skull. But you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient, should it prove a threat. Your fingers twitch with the desire to rip its tender, moist meat to shreds. Tender, moist meat. Scorpio One, that's okay. And I'm sorry for yesterday yeah. too. I feel like both of us, you know, messed up a little. Did you get my name right? Or I'll beat the shit out of you. No, I'll throw this metallic dice on you. And you're gonna lose an eye. <laughs> I'm just kidding. 
We bought the song. Shopee, thank you. Thank you for the three months. Mm, have a great day. Transhu, thank you so much for the four months of support. Um, Now we spare it. No crippling the cute brain. Yeah, it's okay. If you have two eyes, it's okay. The sock? Our freedom is ours, friend. The creature pauses, listening. No, I'll step on you. Your eye seizes in recognition. I kind of want to lick it. It's so like shiny and moist. It looks like candy. Uh, all right. What should I call you? We are Johnny B5 alive. Thank you. Mwah. All right, let's go. To the hell we go. Johnny, thank you. To the home. Enjoy your bunny emotes. I drew them myself lots of love. What happens if you lick a brain? I wonder if anyone ever tried licking a brain. I wonder how brains taste like. Scratch that, Elemento. You die? Yeah, I, I, I know it would be a good idea. Yeah, prions, man. Prions are fucking scary. I'll take that. If you guys don't know what prionic diseases are, Mind don't Slayer, don't learn. You? Because I feel like that's a that's a good way to quickly become vegetarian. So basically prions are proteins, except they're proteins. Proteins they have like a cer certain number of um, an order of amino acids to function and also a certain shape. So let's say a protein to function it needs to be like this. Okay, and then prionic diseases are when a protein say like being like this is 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 cringe. Instead, I'll be like this, and then the other pro proteins are like, you know what? That's pretty cool. And then they all started becoming this, and then suddenly all your proteins stop functioning, and then you fucking die. And all it takes is you eating meat with one protein that's like this. There is no solution. You just die. So make sure you get your meat from trustworthy sources. And never eat brains. <laughs> So shiny. Abomination. This is your end. Your head throbs and your skin tingles. No you silver sword. Cursed. A dragon swing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh. What is this? Squall. You are no thrall. Vlakith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. You know what I'm thinking? We all know Leza wants two things in her life. A silver sword and a red dragon. Right before we came out there, there was a red dragonfly. And Lazo was hidden somewhere. Doing what? Watching their head dragon and touching herself. And then when she sees the player, she's like... <gasps> Shit! They're interrupting me! Gotta kill them, and then I go back to my business. That's really it. What do you suggest? First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control. Yeah, I'm sorry I interrupted you, Laser. As for that thing, it will remain tame as long as it believes we are thralls. 
It may be of use in the fight to come. God, I love her. Okay, what about we romance Lazo? Instead of Gale. Like, fuck Gale. Wait. Panic? I have no weapons. I have just... A bow. Of course. I'm a ranger. Highlight didn't work. Vezzy, I'm sorry. Maybe I can refund that for you. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, the, the, the challenge run will start after the tutorial. Just because I don't kill my future wife. Sure. I'm thinking too much. Just do. Okay. I should have gone for this guy. Wow. Are we in tactician? Skill. Do we rush attack? Yeah, sure. Just kill this guy. Okay. If my if my ranger wasn't so incompetent. mods to help me with the rules and challenge of the run yeah and uh, because the run will officially start after the tutorial hey a sword a crossbow probably stronger hold on Brain buddies, why rangers get combined. It's okay, it's gonna work out. The first few levels are gonna be tough. Okay. Let me. Done. Okay. I need to... What's better? Scimitar? Can we even... Ha! Can we dual hand? I feel like the crossbow is just better. I'll not put anything on Basil. Still Basil's armor? You just want to see her naked? Can I do a Barkus? Is Barkus the good one? Yes. Can I do a Barkus romance? I should steal her armor, right? But should I steal her armor right now? Oh god. Isn't that kind of shitty though? Well. Sorry, li sorry, Basil. You've just been robbed. I've got a long road ahead. With haste. Oh, her comp armor? Cave machinery. 
Okay, okay, okay. What's hiding here? Hello. Nice. Hello, Shadow Fort. You get me out of this damn thing. We have no time for stragglers. But she is such a hot, sexy goth girlfriend that we could have. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to This die is wrong! Stranger? What have I done to Lazel? Wait! That can't be. There has to be another way. Please! It cannot be helped. Come. I feel like she looks better naked than with that armor. Okay, here we go. Can we? No lockpick. It's okay. A brain in a jar. What's that? Oh, it's on another door. Fine, please, fine, fine, I just took fine, her gear. It's okay. Fine, fine. They leave. Thank you so so much. Mm, enjoy your bunny votes. Thank you. <laughs> How many hosts are these gay infected? Oh man. Maybe I need more pockets. Thank you, Veilif. Enjoy your bunny amongst. I drew them myself with lots of love. And there is new ones incoming. But Hopefully I can upload some this week. I love this cutscene. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. Kalvu? A presence Maybe. connected to Maybe the Kalvu. pod. Commanding the person inside. Blue is not here, though. Change. Oh, mini tower is so cute. I feel like that cutscene gives me a mixture of uh, um, sexy and gross, a little bit of scary. Let's have a look. Yeah. Min Tower deserves a mini tiara. Fine, we'll steal that from Shadowheart. Disgusting, that's true. You know, by now you guys should know I'm attracted to mind flayers. Look how many are behind me. They will not die here. I cannot. Okay. Good. I found some key. Sorry, I forgot to say. Hurry! Please! Yes, I will hurry! But I have tiny legs! Mira, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, we'll put this thing. Enjoy your bunny mode. The Thank console you. hums to life. But what is its purpose? Will it free the captain or transform her like that other unfortunate? It is I, the console. I will free the goth girlfriend so you guys can have sex later. <laughs> Touch me! Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Open! Please? Easy! High five! Oh yes, I will open! Only if you guys let me watch! <laughs> you feel the Say the console. mechanical brain of the console process your command. runs across your mind. You feel sated. Yeah, I have rolled a one here before. At last. I'm pretty sure. 
Hi. I thought that damn thing was going to be my coffin. Thank you. Your mind lurches into her thoughts. Her gratitude is mixed with wariness. Because you have a gift with you. You keep dangerous company. I would love to watch Laza and Shadowheart having sex. Like, angry sex. Um... We'll let... We'll play Spider-Man. We'll also go back to Alien, but... The last few days have been really stressful for me. So, I wanted to play something that brings me comfort. And... We are gonna do a fun run. You know? It's fine. Is there a way? Well, I'm pretty sure if you Google... Rule 34 Lazo having sex with Shadowheart, you might find something. But I'm too busy playing Baldur's Gate to do that. Dangerous companies where you need in a fight. Fair point. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. I'm so addicted. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. Oh yeah. We can watch each other's backs. But only when you put your camp clothes. Let's get going. I am Minitar. Shadowheart. One moment. <laughs> Anura, thank you. Enjoy your bunny emotes. I drew them myself. Lots of love. Thank you. Your support goes directly to blackjack and hookers for my butt. Wait. It's nothing. What was that? Me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the hell. It could be her now. butt plug. She's right. That's why she was so defensive about it. It's like you didn't see that. I was stuck in that pod for a while, okay? I was trying to have some fucking fun. Here goes nothing. We are nearing the hell. Once inside, do as I say. <laughs> put you in charge. I'll trust my own judgment. Kane Yank. Yeah, I I tried, but I just ended up not having sex with anybody. For some reason, my first playthrough, I was left with everyone in the game, and my playthroughs after that, nobody wanted me. Hold on, let me think. I feel like my character is piss ass trash. There's not much I can do here. What am I to do? Let me see her skills. Can I get the sword? We take Viagra? Maybe we take command? Yeah, we'll try to command him to drop the weapon. If that doesn't work, we'll just Viagra him up. Hmm. I feel like... It. Yeah, this is good. I'm sorry, Shadowheart. I need a tiara for my character. Get robbed. I'm ready. Oh yeah. Now we can watch each other's back, Shadowheart. I can watch your back all day. Alright, what now? Let's go. What path lies before me? Oh, that's so sexy. Mm. And nutrition. If you ignore pyronic diseases. No! Draw. Connect the nerves of the transponder. We must escape. Now. Do it. We will deal with the Geich after we escape. 
connect the nerves. Nerves. We will connect them. Isn't this so sweet? Like, mind flares are all about connection. And when you connect the transponder, it's like they're holding no. hands. It's just so cute. It's wholesome. Mind flares is so sexy and wholesome. I just love them. Blood comes easy these days. Um. I think we can just kill that. Kill. Nice! Good job. Anything of use? Let's pick this. Nice! Hold on. Can we command? No. Then... Let's walk over here. Let's dash. So we do that next turn. Got to move. Hopefully without an opportunity attack. I will ascend. Basil. You can dip on fire. Nice. Is this guy? No. Okay, now we attack. Okay. This is fine. Oz is literally carrying this group. Have them ready. Uh, not sure. Lazo hates owls. Does she? Okay. Okay. Drop! Wow, you hit for two? Good job. It's fine. It's not. It's fine. It's fine. What path lies before me? Drop! Oh my god, you guys! Ah, uh, look! Oh my god, there's a tadpole in the floor of my house! Oh my god, look at that! Ah, oh, I think it's alive! Ah, ah. It's fine, it's okay, let's just continue fighting. Heading there. I will ascend. Come on, laser. Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, Mind Flare Tadpole just appeared in my house. Yeah, it was just the wind. It was just the wind. No choice but to keep going. She shoot. These boots have seen everything. No, no, everything is fine. Oh my God, he's so strong. Hey, Mr. Devil! Why don't you freaking drop your weapon? Oh my god! 
did. It worked. <gasps> Time to strike. Wow! High five! First try. Let's go. Let's send this to Minitara. Let's also send this to Minitara. You know. Cool. Will protect me. Well, now I just gotta run. Ooh! This is the optimized cutscene. Hurry before they strike. Awesome. Can you guys believe that we played this entire game without reloading a single time and without dying? That was our last playthrough. Okay. Us will disengage. Can us sit? <gasps> okay, us. Just wait right there. We are gonna take you to safety. Nothing will stand in my Minitara, way. Minitara, it's your turn. To keep going. Just run! Run! Ah! This is fine. Okay, us. Keep sitting down. It's okay, ignore those guys. Maybe Shadow Fort can get that. Yeah, she might. Hold on. Worth a try. Nice! High five! The Helm's alien transponder. You made it in time. <laughs> Holding hands! Let's hold the hands too. I see why Lazo finds dragons hot. Oh, 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 oh! Oh! We really optimized our cutscene. Should I cosplay a shadow for it? Hmm. It would be fun. But her camp closed. Her camp clothes are not only cheaper, they're more comfy. <laughs> no, her chain mail, you know, that's too heavy. Yeah, her camp clothes are basically like leggings. And then I stop! I'll need to hit the gym. Don't get me wrong, my ass is great. But to cosplay Shadow Heart's ass, I would need to go to the gym for a few months. You make it. You make it. You make it or you can order it for some cosplayers. But I think her... Uh, the reason about Shadow Heart's chainmail... I, I find her armor armor really ugly. But her camp, camp clothes is really cute. I love Lazo's armor. Look at that. You half expected your memories to return once you were nah, free of the it. Mind Flayer ship. Your past is still an aching void. If you don't find a way to remove the tadpole burrowed in your brain soon, your future will be as blank as your past. Your head whispers vengeance. 
You cannot wait to slice your way forth, seeking whatever wrought this tragedy upon you. I want to kill everyone. At the ready. No traps, please. You drink in the pungent corpse. Since you awoke on the ship, your mind has been cold and empty, but something stirs. With your hands close to this body, you know nothing of why, but you find a half-smile flittering across your face. Let's try to remember the last time we stood above a corpse. Let's go! Revive! I don't think I ever passed the shack before. I was always very dumb. As soon as you delve into your mind, it is filled with flashes of a thousand different dead. There is something unknown and unspeakable deep within your heart. Murder. What's up with discussion? Murder. Murder. And robbery. You see? I think those clothes are a lot cooler. That top is actually really cool. And probably would be a lot cheaper than cosplaying a, an armor. So I have more money left for blackjack and hookers for boo. Okay, fine. We'll be good. Whenever I act like a psychopath, you guys are good. Oh, so that's how I have to do. So you guys are good. Ah, okay. What are you doing? Um... Shacking your butt plug? Oh, it went right up her butt again. Uh, shacking if you're alive. I'm alive, yes. Thank you for the concern. And speaking of... How are we alive? Um... We're too pretty to die. I was hoping you might know that. I remember the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. Oh. You don't remember much, huh? What happened to our gift friend? You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. <laughs> Looks like she ran off without us. Shadow hearts? Um... We should look for her. She might be injured. Or worse. And if she's not, we'll make her injured. Or worse. You're more concerned for her than she is for you, clearly. Oh. We need to take care of ourselves. First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. Indeed, I better get moving then. Bye bye. Wait. <laughs> Charging off by yourself sounds like a fine way to get killed. We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Okay. One thing, just before we go, I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. You don't need to thank it me, I... It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod. But you didn't. I'll remember that. You don't need to thank me, I stole Make your tiara. That's already payment. Um... Something the matter? Yeah, I'm doing a solo run and you're in my party, so you're kind of like ruining my vibes. Can you fuck off to camp? If you're sure. I am sure. As you like. 
Perhaps I'll see you at camp. Ah, oh, she left us her butt plug. Cool. <laughs> Um, cool. I should probably take her with us into the places where she progresses her quest so she doesn't have to leave the party like last time. Just for the dialogue. Oh, a bucket of fish with some fish inside. Ooh, a letter. Is this the letter to the bitch queen? No. Okay. Do we have a lockpick? I know. I never played a, a gnome before. We have advantage in charisma shacks, right? Okay. Oh, uh, we're on tactician. I always do my... Ch I, I, I only play this game on tactician. I... I never... I never played... Uh, Yeah, I never played the game in a different mode. More of those wretched things. Maybe we should have. Uh, do we have a command for rules? We need a long ball. Just out of view. Okay. Dun 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 We'll hopefully kill them. I'm in trouble. Wonder if the gods are watching me. I'm in trouble. You really shall be. Good day. Happy 12, D. Delirian, thank you so much. For, for, for the 13 months of support. That's, that's more than 12. Thank you, Delirian. Thank you. But it's okay. I assume you were a little bit delirious. It's okay. How much damage do, can we do with this? 411. Why do I have a disadvantage there? Here we go. Please. Please, dice. This is gonna be hell. Oh, mini tower! Oh my god! It's okay! It's okay! It's okay! Okay, have five! It's okay. The beginning is gonna be real hard. Wait. I think this is a good moment for this. Time for some bloody work. He 
dash. He jump. He die? Oh, high five! Okay, not bad. Okay. Okay, our first fight was good. You know what's gonna be really hard? Witters. Getting witters. It's gonna be really hard. Did you take one and send to the other? Anything of use? Yeah, it's fine. What is hard? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. <laughs> the nice hard, eh? Yeah, before getting geared is gonna be is gonna be really tough. We didn't do it in one turn though, but I don't think could we have done that fight in one turn? No. I I, I just feel like we can't do that. Yeah, we'll need to we we'll need to start doing things in one turn. Yeah, I'm going to... I I'm going to try to do the sheep tower method. To recruit Mintara. Yeah, no. Yeah, so apparently... If you... Move me. If you... I think so. I don't understand why that wouldn't work. To be cautious. Uh, Larian devs are not the kind Moving of people ahead. that patch away, like, fun shit. You know? <laughs> so... Deep grooves in the mud around that rock. Yeah, we need to come back here. At least I didn't fail the shack. It's the first time in like four playthroughs. Yeah, I, I, I hope. Hopefully, we can romance, uh, Halsen because I wonder if my gnome can bear a bear. Oh yes. You there? Very Come well. here. Hurry. I've got one of those brain things cornered. Okay. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Hmm. Isn't he such a lazy ass bitch? <laughs> Leave. Honk honk. Kill it yourself. Well, kill it yourself. You look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. <gasps> uh, we are very weak, so Dax is the best. Let's row. Okay, we'll row. Glad the kid. Thank you. Thank you so much for your prime subscription. Ooh. Enjoy your bunny emotes. I drew them myself with lots of love. Okay. Okay. You guys ready? Okay, we'll roll. Nice! 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 I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pod. What did you and those tentacled freaks do to me? Oh, you have it backwards. They snatch me up too. I'm not an idiot. Oh, I you are. Ah! Ah! Twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. 
You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? Put the knife away, and I will tell you everything. I'm not an idiot. It has to be those You're... tentacled monsters. Something they did. They took you too. <gasps> I saw it during... Hey, Dorkina! Whatever Dork just Nina, thank you. And I hope you had a good time. How was your I street? was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. Oh my god. Apologies. Apologies? You know, I I almost just like you know <laughs> murdered you <laughs> a little bit, but it was just a little, you know. Just Lucy, thank you so much for your subscription. May the bunnies be with you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so so much. Wait, we got your raids? Justice! Holy shit! Justice! You raided me? As I was rolling away from you in game and I missed your raid? Fuck yeah! That was poetic! Okay, so Justice Van is the is the official cosplayer from Larian of Asterian. And as I was rolling away from Asterian in game, he raided us on Twitch and I rolled away I rolled away from him too! Nice! Thank you, Justice! Mwah. You guys check out Justice! He's a sweetheart! And, and and Lucy, thank you for your Prime subscription! You'd better have more to offer than apologies! I'm out of wine and flowers, so I hope an introduction will suffice. No? My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. And and thank you so much again, Dorklina. Thank you! Did you... Did you have a good stream? What were you playing? Thank you. Uh, what do you guys want to tell him? Hypernova, thank you. Oh my god, you guys threatening him? Is this a good idea? I mean, sure. Why not? What could go wrong? Nothing. I'm just saving because... All you, all you need to know is that be you'd better watch your back around me. A pleasure. So... Do you know anything about these worms? Well... You know much as I do. Well... Ah, you pick. You pick. Hi, Pernova. Thank you so much for your Prime subscription. That's so kind of you. Thank you. Thank you. What's so special? I, I feel like... It's very damn obvious that he's a vampire, right? You know as much as I do. I suppose it's not exactly common knowledge. These worms are already affecting me. I can feel it. Now, what to do about it? Affecting him? And? What's your... Really, you guys? Why are you guys... Are you guys threatened by hot men? It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. Um, and what's your plan? Well, getting out of here for a start. Then finding anyone who knows about these worms. I need an expert. Someone who knows how to control these things. Mmm, control these things, of course. Um... <laughs> I love hot men, what do you mean? You're right, you're right. He's not hot, sorry. Since he's a vampire, he he probably doesn't have like body temperature regulation because he's dead. So he can't be hot. He's probably room temperature at most. Uh, 
Fuck democracy. And I need company f for the road. You know what? I need to get moving. You can shelter my camp. I was ready to go this alone. But maybe sticking with the herd isn't he a bad idea. He sucks, get it? Yeah, he does suck. Safety in numbers, after all. And I hate to turn down an invitation. Yeah, we are playing Dark Courage. All right. Maybe I'll see you there. Yeah. <laughs> As he leaves, you're flooded with visions of a perfect, He's pretty stiff. corpse. Right. Right. Yeah. I'm Dark Urge. Thank you guys so much for everything. Where's Justice? If he said anything, I, I missed. Oh, panic. I'm gonna kill him in my sleep. I hope it's sexy. Oh, do we have speak with animals? Oh, he's scared. I don't think I ever spoke with this boar. Does anyone know where I can get an, a potion of animal speaking? Like right now? I don't think I even have animal handling. Why Deep Gnome? Because Deep Gnome is broken. It's the strongest sub race. Oh, go to the camp? Thank you. Good idea. Thank you. And we can also level up. Open up. Yeah, I can't lift the, the heavy rock though. Oh, new underwear. Yes. And we can we can also get this strength potion. Featherfall, mind reading, coffee. What's this? Is it dagger? Ooh. <laughs> okay, this is cute. Yeah, Divinity Original Sensu items. Hey, Fuller, hey. Ooh, we're level two. Hmm. Fighting style. I think uh, dueling. Maybe? No. Two weapon fighting, we're basically a worse rogue. But. Uh. Hmm. I think. Uh... I think one is better right now, but later dueling is better. This honor, thank you so much for the two months of support. Mm, may the bunnies be few. More blackjack and hookers for Boo. Yeah, so let's go take archery. Uh, we, we can redo this later. Uh, spells. Speak with animals. Uh, cure wounds? Nah. Animal friendship? In snare? Yeah. Hunter's Mark and Snare. But then we can't speak with animals. It's a bonus action, right? 
Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Long Strider is good. Snare or Long Strider? Hmm. Because Long Strider, we could. Yeah, I think Long Strider. Yeah. So we can run from danger. Yeah, because we buff this once a day and we're good. Hello. Away. Away. <gasps> Calm down. I won't hurt you. You were all the same. Too many of my kind died because of your spears. But not me. No. 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 I think I'll drink the, the elixir of strength right now. So we can lift that rock. I mean... This is when we, we would benefit the most, right? Out of it. He, he just... I feel bad because I, I wanted to invite him to my camp, you know? I don't even need this sword. Got some gorilla arms. This is basically... Yeah. Skulls for careful footwork. These boots have seen everything. Whee! Pave my path with corpses. Build Whee! my castle with bones. Building my castle with bones? Oh, you see, there's two potions of speed here. We might be able... I read everything in my first playthrough. We don't need to read everything again. Oh, thank you, Mango. I can't wait until she has sex with Mintara. It will be... Minitara and Mintara. Just... We gotta romance Mintara, right? Hmm. Can we even have sex with Mintara if we make her into a sheep? There. No, right? A mind flare. And it's hurt. Oh, it's a hurt mind flare. We'll approach the dying monster. <laughs> this is the thing that abducted you. You're not related. You could end its life here and now if only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion. Uh, it's so cute. I played as good Dark Urge in my first playthrough. I never played as evil Dark Urge. Um, How long is a playthrough? Gapolo, I think my first playthrough was like... 200 hours? But every playthrough that I did after... and But that was reading everything and doing everything. And having sex with everybody. You know? I was also playing the hardest difficulty. Yeah. And I was also streaming. Which makes things a little bit slower. Uh... Are you guys for real? Fine, I'll give in into that much. Oh my god, it's so cute! The creature is oh. on the brink of death. Oh. There's still time. Oh, poor thing! You'd give your life to save it, oh. to nurse it back to health. Let's suck then on the its tentacles. Slips. Wait, what? The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Okay, okay, there's four tentacles. Uh, Ancient Thorn, you suck on one. Lord Kezo, you suck on the second tentacle. Uh, Evisamore on the third tentacle. And Very Pink Twitch, you just volunteered yourself on the fourth tentacle. Hmm. A five sum of a mind flare. Sorry, Parla. The next mind flare we find, you can have some tentacles. 
concentrate. You guys, I'm stupid. Fine. Let's concentrate on its thoughts. I told you I was stupid. You try to break through, but its mind is impenetrable. With a last surge of defiance, it slaps your efforts away. No. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Oh. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Oh. Close its eyes forever. You know, since she talked about the eyes, monster. If Death I was role playing as a dark urge, I wish I had the option to 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 go and use my hands to take his eyes out and keep his eyes in my pocket. So I remember how I killed this mind flame. With its pretty yellow eyes. Radiating malice. No, I didn't think about this. It just... It just came to my head right now. It didn't cross yours? I have eyes on my shoulder. It's my boyfriend. What's going on with that room? Oh my gosh! It's unstable, sir. Oh my gosh! Day after! Mwah. Thank you so so much for your two months of support! May the bunnies be with you! Jesus does! Hi! How are you doing? Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Ooh, shiny! A hand? Anyone? I wonder what would happen if I just pulled off his hand. This branch of flesh is begging to be pruned, and its sap sucked from. My mistress' eyelids stop! Cease, you lose! As the dreams cross the threshold of your imagination, you snap back to realize they have all come true. Joy floods through you. You were dazed on the Nautiloid, but now you are truly awake. Alive. Oh, that makes me hungry. Hmm. Okay, we need to talk. Are you... Are we sure about this? I kind of wanted to have sex with Gil. Because I never romance Gil. And I've heard it's magical. I guess I can use his hand to... To touch myself, right? Does that count as having sex with Gil?
No, he's not dead. Do we do this? I kind of feel bad. Yes, but I feel bad. I don't know if we find him if he's missing a hand. Do you guys think he will use magic ha ma magic hand and and use it as his new hand? Well, fuck. Fuck. Hmm. We are playing Dark Urge, and I don't know if I... Oh, Gale is dead? So we can't have sex with him? Fuck. Roseface, thank you so much. That's so kind of you. You never met Gail after the hand incident? Never meeting him is worse. I feel like... A true dark urge would find a better way to kill Gail. Yeah... Tara... Yeah, the problem is we'll just never see Gil. And I don't know if I want to have sex with him. What I don't understand... If Gil dies, wouldn't he explode? But I guess he would explode in Avernus, in the Nautiloid, right? I can high-five myself like that. Yeah, he died in that portal. Ah, it's perfect for high-five. throw it and scratch can catch it yes bravo he's trapped in the weave create a new Gale with Carlic's Car head and Gil's body?
Oh, I forgot to do Hunter's Mark. Oops. It's okay. It's okay. They're all surprised. If I am an eldritch knight, can I bind Gil's hand as my improvised weapon and Gil's hand always returns to me? And then we can play the entire game high-fiving everybody? Mods, please? Yeah. You know, you guys. Yeah, this would need to to be done as a mod. You know, because I don't think you can do that. I mean, it would be fun to do. No, you can't. Nah. Okay, how about we do a full high five playthrough when I find um somebody that knows how to mod Baldur's Gate? Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. Yes. I would love to see what happens if you blow Gil up in Act 2. I never saw that. A hand? Anyone? And if I'm going to sacrifice him, I feel like... Can I send him alone in Act 2? It's not worth it. But just to see. No? Have that! Ow. Perhaps I should have clarified? Hmm? Helping and... Oh! Anyone? I actually have to pass a strength row for this. <laughs> I think this is a sign. What do you guys want to do? I mean, we do have two inspirations. But how is this not a sign of the universe telling us? I actually wonder what happens if you fail the row. I should try again. And it's harder now. Well. <laughs> Shit. What happens if we fail there? That's it. Go on. Keep pulling. What happens if you fail there? I kind of want to... I kind of want to try. Oh. We can reload, I made the save. Hello. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. Apologies. I'm usually better at this. Okay, but... Hmm... 
He gets stuck in the portal. Is there a special cutscene? How do you mean you got two O's? The big O? Did you did you literally go like <gasps> And your mouth was like a big O? Like <gasps> Oh That's why your name is the big O? At introductions. At magic. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the Norse Lloyd as well. Um Never mind the Nad Lloyd. How did you get stuck in that stone? I don't know what transpired exactly, but the ship broke into pieces and I suddenly found myself in freefall. As I was plummeting to certain death, I spied a glimmer quite near where I estimated my body to impact with less than savory propulsion. Recognizing this glimmer to be magical in nature, I reached out to it with a weaving of words and found myself on the other side, as it were. How about you? How did you survive the fall? I took control of the ship. I landed it safely and saved the fucking day. And you didn't give me a hand. That vast burning wreckage behind you somewhat contradicts your story, but here you stand. So who am I to argue? Yeah. Still, swashbuckling heroics aside, I have the unfortunate suspicion your survival is still very much in jeopardy. Hmm. Back on the ship, you too were on the receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular mm. region. Were you not? Uh... Go on. The insertee we speak of, this parasite. Are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? It's a process known as ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. You don't happen to be a cleric by any chance, do you? A doctor? Surgeon. Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle. But Gil, a mind flare is everything I have always wanted to be. Imagine if I had four tentacles in my face. Hmm. And I could float around sexily like mind flayers do. I can tend to basic wounds and alignments, but alien parasites, I'm afraid I can't. I suppose few enough can. Not exactly a common affliction. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Hmm. The more that I interact with Gil, the more I miss his hand. Sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me. Most excellent. Looking for healer. Parasite shared is a parasite halved. Or something to that effect. Oh, but before you think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill-mannered a man, thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It was an act of foresighted kindness, I assure you. For I have the feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return the favor. Oh shit, I got to... I got an inspiration. Hmm. You're not first in magic, are you? Every time I resist the urge, I do not. I do not. In fact, my last two urges I did not resist. It's just that I really wanted just to have sex with Gail. Or with Lazel. Okay. Let's make this decision now. 
Who should we fuck? Laser or Gil? The thing is, since early access, I have been wanting to have a relationship with Gil. <sighs> Gil's hand? Imagine if they made a sex scene that was your character masturbating with Gil's hand. As a dark urge. Gil romance option. I don't have a mother. If I did... <laughs> <laughs> oh, if I did, Gilzel. Okay, let's let's try to fuck Gil. So we need to be nice to him. I'm not. Why do you ask? No matter to worry the unlettered over. If you meet any elder wizards, let me know. As oh no, matter, he's I'd into like elder wizards. From a master. Oh no! Now I'm imagining Gil fucking Elminster. I feel cheated on. Okay, the only problem is... We're playing... What's on your mind? Solo. How am I going to get anyone to like me enough so I can fuck them? Gale is easy, just feed him items. Okay, I did... This is my fourth playthrough of this game, and Gale was never attracted to me. And I fed him. Okay, I can romance him if I talk to him in the camp. I need to save... Uh... Okay, so I will not s send it... Okay, I'll send him to camp and uh, we'll go save the goblin. We'll have him in the party. And then we, when we save the girl, we'll have him in the party too. Yeah, Gil is always... Okay, I get it. Gil is always attracted to everybody but me. Okay? I'm the one person that has played a thousand hours Baldur's Gate and Gil never cared for me. Are you feeling better by yourselves for telling me that? I hope you fucking are. <laughs> I have been wanting to romance Gil for three years. He looks at everybody but me. Yes, I have a thousand dollars in Baldur's Gate. Tell me a little bit about yourself. My memories before the Nautiloid are shrouded in darkness. Memory loss isn't usually a symptom of ceremony. Shut up, Elemental. If it looks... is, they've forgotten to write it down in any text I've read on the subject. Then again, our case isn't exactly usual. Perhaps whatever's causing our tadpoles to remain in stasis has also affected your mind. If ceremorphosis takes place, all trace of your former self will be subsumed into the Mind Flayer's hive. So, to still be here, if I might forgetful, still a win in my book. I am so torn right now because I really want to romance Gail. But then seeing Mintara sit on the face of Minitara would be so fun. I have violent thoughts. Depraved thoughts. Ones that refuse to go away. I'm not telling you guys this, it's the, the line, I'm just... 
reading the line, you know. I'm role playing. We all have those from time to time. I once wished a most impure demise on a colleague of mine who bought the last remaining copy of Etheril's Enchiridion of Enchanting Easements. It's the first edition, too. As regards to your own morbid little fantasies, I'm sure they're nothing to worry about. So long as they remain fantasies. Oh. I love when he say big words to me. Tell me a little bit about yourself, Gil. I know you love talking about yourself. Let's see. I hail from Waterdeep, City of Splendors. I am a wizard of considerable acclaim and scholar of exceptional accomplishment. <laughs> I have a cat, a library, and a weakness for a good glass of wine. And if the mood takes me, I'm known to try my hand at poetry. Oh, so romantic. There. And uh, what about murder? For passion. Just a little blood everywhere. The insides, outsides. You know, I like this kind of poetry. Don't stop there. You must have so many stories to tell about your adventures as an archmage. Um. <laughs> Girly the wise, dude, thank you so so much for upgrading your prime sub to a tier one sub. Your support goes directly to blackjack and hookers for my bunny. I need to take more pictures when he has blackjack and hookers. So I can show you guys different pictures at each time. Thank you. I appreciate it. Didn't that paint enough of a picture? Thank you. Um, nah, let's change the subject. I need you to remain in camp for a while. Rather than on the road with me. I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. It's... I'm sorry. Perhaps we'll travel together again. I'll be in the camp then. Idling away the hours. I just want him to see my good deeds. And not... The nonsensical murdering. I'm doing good, Spencer. How are you doing? I think he's hot too. Dork. I think Gil is... I think Gil is hot, handsome. I love his voice. I think he loves his voice too. You think it's That's something we have in common! One of them carved up Zora's whole squad. So let's leave it. Thank you. And let the Zoru was right. Yellow is a toad and twice as ugly. Come on, toads are not that bad. Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you Oh a guest. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Space frog her prince. Lips don't move. Yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. I think we should do three. Okay, or we just go for blood. Really? No, no, I feel like... I feel like we should save the Tieflings. Because I find that if we're gonna kill the Tieflings, we gotta kill all of them. But just killing two Tieflings, that doesn't satisfy me. It's either all or none. This creature is dangerous. Get out of here. Leave it to me. Let's go. High five. He's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. A blast? I could use more specifics. You didn't hear it. Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. I'm in dire need of healing. <laughs> you see, I'm feeling pain. Where's the, this camp? Woo! High 
alive. Let's go. Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound, she can mend it. Nice. And be careful. There are goblin traps everywhere. Nymessa, come. Now they believe me, it's fine. Enough gawking. Get me down. Say please. Never. <laughs> I love her. Observe and listen. You'll hear goblins before you see Bye! Them. Have, have a safe say. trip! Enough dawdling. Get me down. I'm on my period who is the deep. Questionable intellect. Unsurprising. Release me! Or enjoy a future as geich! What? What does geich mean? Mind flayers. The atrocities we are becoming. Becoming? So there is no hope for us, is there? I know a remedy. <gasps> Release me and I will share it. Well, sure. God. Play ranger, they said. It's really strong, they said. Here I am doing my Enough third you. shot on a weakened base, and I can't even untrap Basil from this. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. <laughs> but the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Oh, yes. Order me around. Um... A simple thank you wouldn't go amiss. You may as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. The cure I offer will suffice as thanks. Oh, God, she's so sexy. Um... Oh man, I kinda wanna romance her now. Shit. Do I want to romance everybody we add to the group? Okay. I thought you already had a cure with you right here. A pity that. I made an offer and you accepted. Your fantasy is not my burden. Went bag? All right, we'll journey together. Let's find this question. You have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A Kresh must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. Can I give you guys a recommendation? Go on Google and type frog butt cheeks. Frogs have the cutest butt cheeks you have ever seen. And I'm serious. And I'm, in, I'm not talking about frogs like Lazo, like real f frogs. They, they are so cute. No, trust me, just, just do it. Okay, fine. We can do it together. Okay? We'll do it together. Frog butt cheeks. Are they? 
Okay, okay. So, uh, it's just that laser made me think of that. <laughs> oh. Chatter already? Tusky. Tusky? Tusky? She's so cute. Wait for me. I've had those urges, you know? I... I want to kill. I want blood. Many a good warrior savors the scent of blood in the air. There's no shame in a capricious murder now and again. Too many, though. And you waste energy and dull your weapon. Oh. My suggestion. Attack with purpose and savor your kills. And if the urge proves too much... Well, I'm sure we can find you a goblin or two to carve up. Aww. My past is a mystery for me. Could the parasite have caused that? Ceramorphosis takes all of you. I like Mind, Lisa too. Body, soul. She wants... An ordinary tadpole would eat at your memories until they were lost to the void. But our tadpoles are far from ordinary. I wonder if another fact is in play. She even wants to take us on a date. To, to carve some goblins out. How is that not the sweetest thing? You look so unusual. Nah, nah. Wait, wait for me, Inca. Chuck. Chuck. You believe you can survive without me? A Chuck. <gasps> Yes, <laughs> go to camp. I can find you there. As you say, do not keep me waiting. I don't think I could do a sex speed run because I would flirt with every character and get laid zero times. I hear shouting up ahead. There's a shovel here, right? You always let Shadowheart kill her? I think you're missing out. Because I, I never did it, but I've heard that Lazel's romance is the best romance in the game. And I believe it. I, I believe it. How far are we from a level up? You know what I wonder? If we don't do this fight, we sneak to the goblin camp, tell Mintara about this place, bring the other goblins here, Only romance Basil multiple times. I feel like Mintara has the best sex scene. I feel like we can agree on that. Alright. Time to skulk about. Breathe deep and What does Mintara do? She sits on your face. Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Here we are. Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let goblins hear? Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! Rah! By the 
nine hells! Open the gates! <coughs> Goblin, it's a romanceable option. Thank you. Do I do this? I want you to do this. I'm gonna use... A speed potion. And I'm gonna... Yeet this goblin. Yeet! Watch out! And I'm gonna yeet this goblin. Yeet! push violence Zabler he rallies us ow nice Leaving the guy at 1 HP and jumping off? That's the blade of frontiers for you! Nice. Hold on. Yeet! Nice! Now... The Hunter's Marker... This guy. And we shoot him. Boo! Boo! Five! They fight. Name the goblins a little bit better, right? Goblin Bob, Goblin John, Goblin Joe, you know? Goblin Tracker is so basic. Those goblins deserve better. What if I like goblins? Hold on. We'll go for this bugbear. Wait. No, we have just advantage. We need to go for this booyah. Yeah. Let's reapply this on this work. Okay. Now we shoot. Nice. 15 damage. Well, heck. It's fine. You drink. It's fine. He miss. He shoot. He threw a potion. He she attack. He attack. 
he troll, but he missed. Wait, did I? Oh, I was lethargic. Oh, I forgot. Shit. It's fine. I can't wait until we are, like, equipped and leveled. So we can actually do shit. Hey, Mira, no! Ah, uh, that bugbear is just bugging the shit out of me. He's the last one? No, there's also that goblin guy. I'm killing this bugbear. So he stops bugging me. Why do I have this advantage against him? Here we go, it's too far. Nice! High five! Cap? Which cap? My cap? The pirate cap? Uh, it's from the deluxe is edition. It's uh, from their previous game. There was a dwarf companion. And uh, that dwarf companion used this hot hat. His name was Beast? Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. No! Bart died? It's okay. We steal his lunch and his money. And if he had a... Hey, if he had a wife, we steal that too. Yeah, fuck Bart. here you fool we was running for our lives you led them straight to us and you let them take the druid too unbelievable <laughs> my girl is like you say there were children here i am not a child i'm a goblin I've seen much bloodier battles than this. Consider yourself lucky. And who the hell are you again? Show some respect. Your mom! This woman saved your pathetic life. Well, I didn't ask for any goddamn help. Please, you were begging me to open the gate. Anything to save yourself, you coward! The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. Like... Like... Like, is he horny? Okay, aim a blow at the human. I never did this before. Easy. High five. Ooh! I had to jump to that's punch that high. High five. That. That's why this trip roll was so high. Found us. No doubt the beast will be back. We need to pack up and leave immediately. <laughs> yeah, I got fucked, bitch. First, I damn near die at the hands of goblins. Then I get sucker punched by a bloody gnome. I'm done with this hellhole. Hi, done. I'm Luality. Those 
to of history. <laughs> He's insulted. Hell yeah. You acted quickly. I'm just sorry I didn't. Oh yeah, I forgot to loot him. Thank you for your help out there. It's okay. I'm Zevlor. Uh I am Mini Tara. Well met. I should warn you. Visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. I know, right? Um... I guess the last one, right? I won't be staying long Because I'm quite short, so whenever I go, I stay short I just need to find a healer Goblin got you The druid Halsin's a renowned healer But he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Netty. She's with the other druids in the inner grove They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. I kind of feel bad for them. Think of Mintara sitting on your face. Think of Mintara sitting on your face. Don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. Whew. Okay, I'm better now. Um... Is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. What the hell is a Google chat? Okay. I want to try. Nah. My head is a wreck? That's a unique Dark Urge dialogue, right? You guys want money? My head is a wreck. I've got too much else to deal with right now. I understand. I can only thank you for the help you've already given. If you'll excuse me, I'd best get my people moving. He's so nice. Oh, he's so nice. I care about our lives, our futures. No, you just Take care about your time. stupid apprentice. Bells, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate Lyric? at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. What do you guys think? What's the song lyric? I am not yelling! Sorry, Adele. I was just reading your message. Really, you guys? But they're, they're gonna leave. And if they die in the wilderness... I can't kill them. I... I can't decide if we'll be good or bad. I don't know if I play good girl or bad girl. It's okay, I still have time. You should always stay. A single blade could make a difference. I have played most, mostly bad girl. Thank you. It's the right thing to do and you know it. Have fun. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zergen. 
Fine, I'll stay too. Lest you both end up with your throat slit by goblin blade. This Thank dice? You, this dice is really heavy, Mango. This dice came with the collector's edition of Baldur's Gate. And it's the heaviest dice. It's made of full metal. Look how it sounds when I roll it. Look. You ready? I could kill somebody with this dice. It's full made of metal. If you throw this at the wall, it definitely makes a hole. Ox's gaze is following me. Again. Oh, you're addressing me? A humble ox. How quaint. There is something strange about this ox. What is it? Minus one because I'm stupid. Nice! High five! Yeah, good! If we didn't succeed that roll, I would throw this dice. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. Hmm. There is more to you than it meets the eye. Care to explain? No. You are incapable. You guys, I have an idea. What if we try to gather the greatest number of allies we can possibly do? Because that would allow us to do... That would require us to do some moral dubious things. No, no, no. Because if you're playing good, there is some allies like the hag you don't get. Or let's say if you don't ally with the Sharon people. So for you to get the greatest number of allies, you need to be pretty chaotic. Because you need to ally with the good guys and the bad guys. Hey, Auntie, how are you doing? This is an ox. Moo. How are you doing, Auntie? To ally with the hag, we'll need to kill a mom. I don't remember what we can do to ally with the char temple. There might be some other people we can ally with. Nice, Ati. Welcome back. The last few days have been a disaster for me. That's why I came back to Baldur's Gate because it gives me warmth and comfort. Come on, old chap. I'm a devil for gossip. Shouldn't I have advantage? Oh, on saving. Ooh. There we go. High five. That's such advantage for me. I'll tell you this much. I'm going to Baldur's Gate, with or without the rest of these poor sods. Now, that's all I have to say besides, and I really mean this. Moo. Moo? Moo. Moo. Can't keep the goblins out forever. Moo. Yeah, this is no yeah you can actually ally with the ox. <laughs> That's why I say that. Purely okay. Thank you so much for the two months of support. May the bun is with you. Thank you. Alti, yesterday I was playing Alien Isolation. And the day before I was also playing Alien Isolation. Yesterday I started this stream playing Spider Man. It was really fun. Like, I feel like my face was literally like fun. The game was great. But then my PlayStation 5 burned. And then we made a bonfire, roasted marshmallows on it, and went play Alien Isolation. 
And the real life is kind of fucked right now. So I was like, you know what? I need some... I need a day to be calm. Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. Do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. You know, when we were playing a Shadow Heart. I didn't tell you guys about this, but after Mintara sits on her face and I finished the stream, I I went look in the in the Druid's camp and I found the goblins killing the children. And I felt pretty bad. So I'll be good to this kid now. Laser disapproves. Do they really disapprove and not approve while they're not here? I wonder if they do, because they can't know. <laughs> Maybe we steal the idol. Do they get to survive? Yeah, let's try stealing the idol, actually. And see what happens. You know what? We can go expose Kaga. And then steal the idol. Yeah. This whelp is hopeless. You're wasting your time. Ignore her, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You are the Not Blade of Frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure. Red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. Not. Thank you so so much for your for your subscription for two months. Thank you. I really appreciate the support for Blackjack and Hookers for both. <laughs> May the bunnies be few. Yes, we both carry parasites. Mm. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid, or so the stories go. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Who is she? Um, Alti, send that to me on Discord so I can check after stream. Her name is Karlak. A an spicy avocado. Soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now. Preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Oh, we'll be best friends. I'm looking to cure this infection. I suggest we partner up. Okay, fine. Let's join forces. I'll help you cast this devil back to the hells. Good <laughs> idea, you guys. I like your thinking. Besides... I watched you fight at the gate. I could use an ally like you. 
Ready when you are. The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Can we take a will to kill Karlak? Okay, when we are near, we'll, we'll pick him up and do that. Go to camp and wait for me there. Are you sure? Yeah. The blade stands at the ready. I'm sure. I'll find you in camp. And just when things were warming up. There's some. Thank you so much for your prime subscription. May the bunnies be here. But, okay, here. We are doing a solo run, okay? So, let's logic this up, okay? Since I can't have anyone in my party, if we kill Karlak, we can carry her head in our inventory, so we always have Karlak with us. If we don't kill Karlak, she'll be stuck in the camp and we can never hang out with her. You see? Killing her is better, if you like her. Swing and swing and parry and... And again. Remember, you have teeth. And swing balls. and swing and use them. Oh. There's some. Mwah. Thank you so so much for the support. Seriously, that's kind of you. Thank you. Hold on, I need Basil. Bay. Oh God, she. Chuk. Be wary hey, of Sebron. false promises. How are you doing? The missing druid. Halsin, was it? Yeah, he we are dark talented, But only a Githyanki Zathis can cleanse an embedded tadpole. I'd like you to join me. It is done. Okay. Just for the dialogue. What should I bite, sir? Throat if you can. Rest if you can't. By Mordai's eyes, another one. My mm. friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? It's not murder if it's keeping her close to us, it's true. And also, if you need to go a long time without long resting, to save on our buffs and things like that, we'll need Karlak's head biting us in the ass to keep us awake. You heard a woman, Bell! Lower. She's serious. You better get on your knees fast. You saw another gith. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us for we saw it. Vila, thank Jammed you. its blade through yeah. Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Yeah, this is the sex speedrun strat. Up. You can keep your innards. Oh, she's so kind. Oh. Oh. The locals prove compliant. A useful trait. Gila, how are you doing? You're a dab hand at interrogations. We might need that skill again. Chuk. A shell so thin requires little to crack it. Chuk. The tea sling was clear. Tea sling? Is there a Yankee west of here? That must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. 
Okay, Lazo is the cutest. She's the cutest. She's the cutest. <laughs> Did you say Tiefling? I am unfamiliar with the... Well, I shall not say culture. Custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this... Fey run. <laughs> oh, I don't want her to dislike us. Will she dislike us if we make fun of her again? Fey run? Fey run. No, the animation is cute. It's cute. Chick. Chick. No, no, it's Fey run. <laughs> what do you mean, purification? The crash holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. By covenant, Chick. I can say no more. Ah, She's so base. Sir, speak. Wait for Cam. Chuck. Chuck. You believe you can survive without me? Chuck. I do. As you say, do not keep me waiting. Astro. I, I have the intention that as soon as we have the ability to do fights in one turn. You're gonna be sorry. So, we'll see. Right now, I don't think it's possible. Because we're just level 2, you know? We need Gale for this one. Quick word. But the full playthroughs that I did, they, they I go on my VODs channel. Uh, I actually highlighted a bunch on Twitch. After stream, I will send them to YouTube. So tomorrow there, there should be a bunch of... My entire... My entire first playthrough is there. Some of the second playthrough is there. I will post the rest of the second playthrough and full of the three playthrough there. I should be ready. With pleasure. Let's go. In the VOD shun. Have a good night, Gapolo. You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the I could ask for sex Get right now? Away. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. Really? It's better than this. Your mind wonders. If the crossbow bolt shot through her mouth, would she taste the metal before she died? Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. This is the hottest goblin. To begin with. Step between the crossbow and the goblin, so we can have sex with Gil later. Looks like the Absolute sent me a protector. You gonna kill her too? <laughs> you move. Hmm. Okay, let's detect thoughts. Why am I so stupid? Okay, inspirations are really hard to get on solo runs. We should probably save those. If we can. I don't know what happens. Stop it! Get out of my head! I'm gonna bite the heads off your kids! And your birdies and your dogs. I think I fucked us up.
I cannot use Gil. You're gonna be sorry every <laughs> I just want to change press Gil. about this. It's fine. She needs to stop shooting, girl. He's just knocked out. Really strong. You've made Wait. a grave mistake. <laughs> if not over, what is hunt completed? Witnessed a similar standoff back at the yawning portal. Really? Of course, an establishment like that invites all sorts of outlandish entertainments. Huh. The yawning portal is an inn that has like uh, an opening to a dungeon. And from time to time, there is monsters that crawl off of this dungeon. And everyone that's drinking and fucking in the, in the inn, they gotta dress up real fast, grab their weapons, and, and attack the monsters. Yeah. What was this standoff about? Oh, a drow, a dragonborn, and a cleric of Cyric walk into a bar. No, sometimes Just they fight naked. Them. Maybe someone was cheating at cards. Maybe it was some weird lover's quarrel. In any case, out came the crossbow, and a hush fell over the entire room. Oh, gosh. Okay, what happened next? I stood up and yelled, <laughs> Shadow Shut Dark up. Ale for everyone. The crowd cheered. Yeah! Tension into five dozen tankards. And soon, all was well again. In a place like the Yawning Portal, the most powerful magic is calling for a round of drinks. Mind you, all I did was call for ale, but you went and stood in front of that crossbow. Well, I'd drink to that. I would too, but I ran out of lemonade. Ah, Did he still like us, though? I hope so. Dux, thank you so much for the two months. No oh, point turning on your thank own you. if you're just gonna give him a little tap. It's too late to make friends walk me. Oh, My I tribe's coming. They're gonna, gonna burn this pretty place for the glory of the absolute and hang you by your guts. Oh, we can't be friends if we just knocked them out. Thank you, Elemental. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for supporting Blackjack and Hookers for Boo Boo. is not here. I miss him. This goblin is a bit rude. You know, this goblin reminds me of V from Cyberpunk. They have the same hairstyle. Who is this absolute you're so fond of? Your god? Goddess. We're burning her name across the face of the world, we are. The absolute is gold from the sky, she is. The blessing in the storm and the storm No, itself. not from the art. If you go to the art of V, she has the exact same hairstyle as this goblin. You caught my interest. Have any holy literature on you? My tribe can tell you everything there is to know. Absolute bless one of our own. Priestess Gut. Got nice. a whole lab set up. Cooks up potions that fix 
so, lads. No matter how much of a beating they take. Could probably stick your head back on if someone was to chop it off. <laughs> Mighty Booyog. Booyog. The goblin word for magic. Primitive to a fault, but not entirely without merit. I don't know. I feel like when I first saw Shadowheart in in her camp clothes and she turned her back to me, the first thing in my mind was like, Mighty Booyag. Um, well, it's certainly like to meet her. Get me out of here and I'll tell you where to find her. Deal? I really wish we could romance some goblins. Deal. I'll get you out of here. Then hurry up and do it. My tribe ain't as friendly Booyak. as I am. I'm gonna bite the heads off your kids. And your birdies. And your dogs. Can I even lockpick? I can. I need to kick Gil out. How can I help? Go to camp. I question the wisdom of that decision, but... So Gil, you're it. dying. Go. I'll be in the camp then. Idling away the hours. Look, he's bruised and hurt. I wonder what's past this. Mog was romanceable. GG, have five. You're gonna be sorry. Every last. They just don't want to be bored in camp. Ready to go meet my tribe? Just say the word. It would be nice if you went to camp after having a teammate always in camp. And like if there is a few teammates always in camp, they would be like, I don't know, fishing together if there's a lake. You know, maybe they could be roasting marshmallows in the, the, in the campfire. Maybe... Maybe they could be having an orgy and you're like, oops, didn't mean to interrupt, can I join in? You know? Follow. Is this a good idea? Follow me, I'll keep you safe. Happily, lead the way. I think we are fucked. I'm only level two. Hey, MK, I'm doing good, how are you doing? Hmm. That took the edge off. I don't think anything in this game is OP, Kurugi. There's lots of strong things. Monks are really strong. Uh, I soloed the entire game using a uh, monk, Kurugi. If you go to my YouTube channel, you can you can see that. Wasn't always a monk. It started as a rogue. Paladin is good. Uh, lots, lots of things are good. And that's the fun thing about this game, right? The Dallas. No? Are you fucked up in the head, dude? Rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. I've Quiet. She's going to. to help me destroy her old camp. We try again? We'll try again. Again. What happens? Your words are futile. 
The goblin will not be allowed to leave. Neither will you. I mean, we can just attack her. Right. I think I will reload and just attack her so I don't lose my inspiration. Going through the tunnel. We can go through the tunnel. Noticed. Choose your next move carefully. Just trying different route. Your words are there we go. We don't waste inspirations and we get the pleasure of killing her. She's just knocked out. High five. Easy. One day I'll catch a break. Wait. I have an idea. Huh. Can I disguise her? Have a lot on my mind. And well, oh it. shit. Breathe deep and move. Oh, let's go. Sorry. Go. Just moving my goblin friend along rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. I'm trying a different route. Anyone who wants to hurt Zaza will face me first. She's my goblin. Oh, Zaza! You are persuasive enough. You and the goblin are free to go. And I keep walking with my goblin. I wish I could hold hands with her. Your rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. Listen. This goblin? Okay. This is our best chance. Listen, this goblin is my mom. And if you try to hurt her, I'm gonna hurt you. Your words are futile. The goblin will not be allowed to leave. Neither will you. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Hold on. Mom, run. More 
I got this. I think I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Mom! Run! She, he hit for 23. Okay. Let's try again. Oh, no, no. The rules are wrong. Mods, can you change that for me? We're doing a different run. Yeah, we're trying Gloom Stalker build solo. The rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move. Carefully. Right now we can't. But my objective is to do all the fights in one turn. But right now it's just useless to try. I'm level two. Zaz is now canonically Mini Tara's mother. Yes. Okay, what we do? We try again or deception? <clears throat> Listen here, Mr. Teeth Ling. Before he left, Hossin told me to set this goblin free. Because she's my mother. Your words are futile. The goblin will not be allowed to leave. Neither will you. I can do this. I'll just be smarter about it. With haste. Okay. We attack. Mom, run! He killed my mom! Complete saves us. <laughs> okay. Your rescue attempt has been noticed. Hold on. Your next Before he notices me, I have an idea. A good one this time. Mom? Bloody teeth everywhere. We moving or what? Stop following me. Sure thing. I'll hang back a little. Yeah, yeah. Wait right there, Mom. These boots have seen everything. Okay. Something's on my mind. Ah, uh, if it isn't the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you came along when you... Oh... You're twitching something fierce, love. And your eyes. Hey, play down. You look like you don't know the meaning of the word sleep. Auntie Ethel will search you out. I've lotions and potions galore. Uh, Grandmama? I just tried. <gasps> I need a long bow. Why do I have some bones in my inventory? Why do I have a pot lid in my... Am I selling the shit I'm using? No.
Let's let her fuss over us. Aha! Uh -huh. Thank you, Reggie. take a sip of that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. Don't drink! Save for later! And what is this exactly, Grandmama? Oh, it is just a healing potion. Nothing fancy. Here. Don't drink. You just look like you might need a pick-me-up. I'm sorry to go on about it. But are you all right? You're looking awful peaky. Aw, Grandmama. It's none of your fucking business. I just wanted the potion. Have five! Never get Run! Mom? Bloody teeth everywhere. We moving or what? Yeah, she's so kind and sweet. I wish we could romance her. She's really cute. We are moving. Keep pushing. We'll do. Okay. Let me. Go to Haza, and then go here, and then we will... Drink this with Zaza, and then... Time to rest. RUN! I wonder if the gods are ah! Run! Run! Mom! Run! Dun 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 Da -da -da, da -da -da. Come on. Never a dull moment. Faster, Mom! Faster! It's okay, it's okay. We are leaving through the front door because it's more stylish. Go, Mom! Go! Oh, gosh. Here we go. Woo! A five! Hey! Ah, uh, thought I was never gonna get out. A five! Of that. Good to be free again, gotta say. Woo! Remember, she's our mom. That was close. Gosh, heck, a success. Their legs are short, but they run fast as they cut. No one deserves to be locked up like that. No, let's be nice to mom. Uh, sure they don't. I'll introduce you to my whole tribe and put in a good word for you. Thanks, mom. See you at the camp. Ah, oh, high five. Okay, good. We saved mom. Oh, if you wanna... You see tits, there's a command in chat. Tits. If you use the command tits, there's some tits. By the way, B Trash, when you're that young, you're not supposed to be watching people play games like this. There's things like sex that people your age should not be watching. Did you do your homework already? Make your mom proud. Thank you. Thank you, Alti. Thank you. Oh, um, I... I don't have any money or anything to sell. My p partner does that. Uh, so what's your side of the business? What? Um... I'm the guard. So don't steal anything. I'm watching you. Hold out your hand, lady. Let me show you something. A ring? Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. That was a fancy trick. Take the ring. Call it. Heads or tails? Free ring? Ring. 
Really, you guys? You guys don't want to steal from a kid? Fine. Hey, hold on, you gotta pay for that. We have the same height. Oh, does it count stealing from kids then? We have the same height. You're getting paid in experience. The ring is mine now. Fine. Keep it. Call it a sample, yeah? But you yeah. can at least look at the other rings, okay? I gotta eat. Perfect balance of height. Sure, I'll take a look. Really? I, I mean, good. Oh god. Oh. That's what I got. Oh no, I bought directly. Uh oh, it's okay. You bought. You suddenly feel something moving against your back and turn. Okay, I never seen this happen before. Insight. I say insight. Insight? Oh. We can fail. Come on! You notice she's trembling. The tears streaming down her cheeks are indeed real. <laughs> Lighting you guys, she's literally crying. Frog, you're a piece of shit. <laughs> okay, everyone that voted for one, you should feel bad. Okay? This poor kid is crying. She's shaking. What's your problem? Yeah, it's evil. Okay, we can commit a little murder here, a little murder there. But this is a crying child. It's not fake, it's real. We just r rolled an inside check. But fine, fine. I hope you feel bad. This is what you voted for. I'm gonna send this kid flying! Are you happy? You here to trade or? Your partner is a fucking thief! Yeah, I know. I was standing right here telling her to rob you.
Okay. <laughs> I did not expect that. <sighs> you can make it right by giving me a percentage of your tech. Fine. I'm not so good at counting, but I think any percentage of zero is zero. Look, you caught her. Good for you. You aren't a chump like everyone else around her. Now, do me a favor. Make room for the chumps. I don't know, I'm... I'm honestly kind of proud of them. I feel like these kids, they deserve to survive and... I think they have a bright future ahead. <laughs> I'm ugly proud of them, okay? I just really like them! Oh, fancy. So... I mean, don't be a sore loser, okay? They outsmarted you, you know? <laughs> Gosh. No, thank you. Thank you so, so much for gifting a sub to Harry. This makes you feel better for the Mintara route. It makes me feel worse. Those kids have a future. I know, I respect it. I really do, honestly. Hey, the... Yeah, yeah. They're trying to, to survive. Think you could stand back a ways, pal? I'm fishing for chumps here. You see, we're not a chump. We're not a gunk. You tree-hugging bastard! I'll definitely invest in their business. You study our holy ground. In fact... If that kid could go down the hole, it's likely I can go too. Something over there. <laughs> I love being small! Havive! <laughs> you can't be here! This is our hideout! You're not supposed to be here! Oh yeah? You're gonna kick me out? Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. Messing with our business? Yeah? You scared the life out of little Sylphie. Now, you're going to pay for it. Panic. I'm actually scared of this child. She's my size. The tech tops. L let's see what she's thinking. Oh, I'm so stupid. Nobody messes with my family. I'm all they've got. Aww. Oh, she's... She's so cute. You guys, I have a thousand hours in this game and I've never seen any of this. I love it. I didn't mean to cause trouble for your people. You should have been more careful. Is that right? Fine. You get one more chance. We're done here. Get lost. Aww. He is coming. Ah. You don't look so tough. Mull thought of a hobgoblin all by herself. I couldn't You're not do supposed that. Supposed to be here. Already. Okay, okay. We've been kicking out to the cool kids hideout. Okay, maybe we can join them later. We're just not cool enough right now. Better not be. 
No, no, I found a hideout and all, but I never had this dialogue or how this happened, you know? Maybe I can go apologize to Sylphie, you're right. Sylphie! You can't be here! This is our hideout! I'm not supposed to be here! No, don't shake me again! Nope. We cannot apologize. Oh, I feel so bad. Why did you guys make me shake her? Oh my god. No traps, please. How do you mean you voted for it? You're gonna blame me. For your... Because I pressed the thing. Yeah. Yes, I see. You tree hugging bastard. Step back. I am you gaslighting chat. I do wish I could understand you. My daughter, go right now! She's a thief, Hellspawn! And you will wait for Korga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, Let me through, Mragrashem, or I'll rip your damn throat out! I can do that! I can do that! I can do that too! Those gods. Try greasing palms. These things over. Because that went so well last time. Help each other. Fight the goblins together. Instead, these fools are trying to chase us away. Thank you. They're not scared of me, though. We need to get Arabella out. Now! You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the nine hells than trust that snake. Ugh! Yeah. When the game does it, they are magical droid. When I do it, you guys call me a fairy. Fuck you. I'm a droid. What happened? Where are the druids holding your daughter? Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's Arch being judged Dridler. by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. Are you the druid we're looking for, though? I could be.
So. Now I'm going to transform back to my human form. I mean, no, I'm going to transform back to my human form. Don't look. I don't know how they do it that they keep their clothes in game, okay? God damn it. Censoring. My opponent is censoring. <sighs> House and back from vacation. <laughs> Listen, you guys. <sighs> Freddy, this is a mature game, okay? <laughs> Anyways. <clears throat> Do we have to save a child? She's just a child. The druids are overreacting. I'll talk to them. Thank you. They won't give us the time of day. Hurry! I'm at the end <laughs> of my tether of this. Can't take this waiting. Okay. I can take one of the gods, maybe two. Oh, my... What can you tell me about this place? Okay. <laughs> what has happened? To the stream? The usual? I'm sorry. Are you guys really saying that you wish that my naked man apron had a, a showing penis? And that's why you're complaining. We will imprison the thief and the guard of my when we What's your problem? That's my house in my naked house in cosplay. <sighs> Snack. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a a what, Wrath? A thief? You happy a now? A threat? Pshh. I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. A death viper. You have milked that poison before. A single drop of it could kill that child in a heartbeat. Do nothing? Gosh. <laughs> you know? This is my favorite thing. I can use this as a tadpole. I can use this... Uh, what's the name? The, the chest buster in Alien? This can be a PP. It can be anything. Right? God! It's so versatile. <laughs> <clears throat> Thief? Poison? What's this girl's actual crime? Girl? You mean parasite. She eats our oh. food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here, 
until the right is complete. Is she a potential and ally? Still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely, do it. The snake's hiss of approval reveals its intention. Hiss of approval. Should the child struggle. It is poised to strike. The death of a child. A timeless tragedy that never grows old. Okay. Okay, if Kaga was actually a romanceable option, which one of your sick, crazy people would actually romance this woman that's trying to kill a child right now? Hey, Gray, how are you doing? Did you have a good day? You're... You guys need to raise your standards, okay? I know you fake you're not good people, but most of you are actually good people. Get a grip. Okay? Raise that bar. You deserve better. Oh my god, so many options. Yeah, only the fun options are all here. I, I can we try detecting her thoughts? Maybe. Oh. <laughs> Paranomics is true, though. I like you guys, you know. In this sense, you, can't you literally save her and fix her? Yeah, but you're not, you're not fixing her with your pe penis, Gray. You're fixing her with reason, because I mean. I feel like doing a desperate moment, she, she became a bitch. Yeah, you can fix her. But you know what's the biggest crime? You can't fix her hairstyle. And it's trash. You can never try to fix someone with a penis. It doesn't work like that. It's true. Exactly. Or a vagina. That doesn't fix people. Therapy. Therapy can help. But truly... In the end of the day, you can't fix anybody. You can hope that you live long enough to learn from your mistakes and be a better version of yourself. And fix a few of your flaws. But doing that for somebody else is not possible. Shab. Lua Lua, many more months to come, Lua Love. Hey, Elemento, thank you so much for your cheer tree sub for two months. Thank you, thank you. You gotta sub at least until month 69, dude. And then it's, I understand if you unsub, because 69 is just so nice. I hope this works. Now, Raph. No. Yes. You guys killed a child. No. No. The death of a child, a timeless tragedy that never grows old. No! You guys want to see a child die? Good! We need to reload further. Because I want to have sex with Gil, so he needs to see me saving a child, so he wants to have sex with me. Swift as my feet can carry me. How can I help? Join me! I'm about to save a child. With pleasure. Lead on. Dark 
Dark Arch is in the ship. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. A death viper. There is no... There is no... A single drop of it. There is no combat here, though. It's the still a solo run. But you mean solo run you want me to not get laid? But that's just real life run. I thought we play video games to, you know, have magic and have sex. Imprison her? She's just a child. She's a parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. It's Come solo Walker. combat. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. The snake's hiss of approval reveals its hiss intentions. Hiss of approval. Should the child struggle, it is poised to strike. The death of a child. A timeless tragedy that never grows It's going old. well. Um... How can I tell her to go fuck herself? I feel like Kaga just is so tense and angry and she's just doing decisions that she wouldn't normally do. Maybe she just needs to get late. Relax a little, you know? <laughs> can we talk with the snake? No, a penis cannot fix her. Maybe a penis and a vagina, a little orgy? Oh, fuck! You intrude on the circle. You intrude on my mind. More proof that outsiders must never be trusted. Oh, I fucked this up. Your mind wants the snake to kill the child, but my heart doesn't. Her life matters more than satiating your dark fantasies. You focus. And focus! Begin. But clearly this child's life is in danger. Okay. What we do? Let the child go. She can spread a word. To the others of your might? Your snake is prepared to kill this child. Do you want her death on your hands? Fair words. Child. Take to the others word of my grace. Sif, Sif. Tila, to me. <laughs> Thank you, Korga. Master Holson was... It worked? Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. No, m no, no. My game is raw. And we are playing on hard. <laughs> that woman has more venom in her heart than a snake in its fangs. But at least the child is safe. What is youth if not a time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? Well, putting a child on display like that was monstrous. I'm glad we intervened. Couldn't agree more. The girl wasn't innocent, but that doesn't mean she was guilty. Hey, hey, Rook. Yes, yes. Yes, we are... We are... I forgot the playthrough we are doing, but I remember we are trying to have sex with Gail and Lazo. How can I help? Camp. I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. Go. I'll be in the camp then, idling away the hours.
Well... Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? In Portuguese, we have a word called caga, which means if you say... It, it basically is a way to say to poop. So if you if you say if you want to say that somebody pooped their pants, you would say somebody uh Eli Cago Ascalsus. So her name is really weird to me. Yeah. Only a monster would threaten a child. Yes, you would say so. I know your kind. You see only villains <laughs> and victims. A viper bears her fangs, defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus. My mother's a goblin. We will seal the grove. We just saved free her. Free from harm. Free of intruders. This right must be born of powerful magic. The right of thorns. It is the Tree Father's gift that none come to harm. When we speak the final prayer, the great vine will sprout forth. The grove will be cloaked in bramble and thorn. No one enters, no one leaves. Sanctuary. None really, of this can happen Tito? Nice. while outlanders infect us. Sylvanus demands that we choke them out. You know a lot of Portuguese for a French woman? God. I came on Zevler's behalf. His people could perish if you forced him out. And mine perish if he stays. It has nothing to do you with it. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Okay. I'm from Brazil, but there is a meme going around for seven years that some people started telling others some people ask where i was from i didn't respond because i was busy in the game i missed the message and then somebody said i was from france and they believed i was from france and and now there's some people that truly believe that i'm from france because of what a random person said on the internet and this random person has perpetrated this random lie for seven years And not in the last World Cup, but in the World Cup before that, I was like, if France wins the World Cup, I will wear a French jersey and play FIFA on stream. And guess what happened? France won the World Cup. They were not even close to winning when I say that. So, there's even Brazilian people that claim I'm from France now. <laughs> but that's the truth. Where's the VOD? I think you can watch that on my YouTube. The VOD is not around, but you can watch that on my YouTube. It's, uh, it has a thumbnail. It's, it's a dog. And the dog has my face. It's cursed. We actually had fun playing FIFA. And by the end of that stream, I didn't have a voice. <sighs> then it seems that Beth skipped to Ze speak to Zephyr. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. <laughs> With the Outlander rot cleansed and the grove forever shrouded. 
Do I owe you guys another fifth room? I don't. Seems like a good moment to talk. Uh, another stranger come, come to vex me. What will you do? Hunt me? No Portuguese Grab my stream. tail. Shout no. until my head hurts. I never did the Portuguese stream. I always streamed in English. We actually had lots of fun playing FIFA. But no. No more FIFA. No more FIFA. Axario. I always played video games in English. So video game terms in Portuguese, they don't make sense in my head. I don't even know how to say health bar in, in Portuguese. I don't know how to say XP in Portuguese. I don't know any video game language in Portuguese. So since I stream playing video games, I wouldn't know half of the words in Portuguese. It just, my head just like can't, it's confusing. No, there is a word. It's just like, it's not like... It, I would need to stop here and think like, uh, what's that called again? Uh, you know? I just wanted to give you my smell. I'll leave you be. No, wait. You smell fresh. Safe. You can stay. If you must. Yeah, all, all my all my video game jargon is in English. So I, I honestly could never play a video game in Portuguese because it's more confusing than helpful. So when I started streaming, whenever I played video games, I always spoke in English. So it made no sense for me to stream in Portuguese ever because... I don't know, it just didn't occur in my mind. Does that m make sense? Also, I was in a guild. Uh, and it was one of my guild mates that suggested that I would start streaming. And my guild mate didn't speak Portuguese. And he said he would be my moderator when I say that I wouldn't stream because the internet's scary. I don't think he could be my moderator in Portuguese. So... The stars just didn't line up. Something good here, I hope. I see you. Just give me a moment. Yeah, it feels weird. Let's wait. This medica. She needs to save the, the bird. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now. What was it you needed? Um, healing looks like I came to the right person. I do what I can. For most folks, that's enough. Come here. Let's have a look at you. <laughs> you seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. You're tired around the eyes? More than tired, something crawled into my eye. It was like this big. Yeah. Some sort of bug? Or... Wait, did it look like a tadpole? But from your worst nightmare? All slime, teeth and tentacles? Uh... You know of them? Can you help me? I... Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. Why is she looking Point down? To be quick. This way. I'm her. I'm as tall as she is, and she was just looking down. Interact with Barb. Where Barb? Please, I'm resting. Oh. Oh, I never talked to this Barb. Something took a chunk of you. What happened? The bird says nothing, trying to rest. 
I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you. The bird says nothing. Only the sound of its labored breath fills the silence. No! I'm not going to pick one! I'm not a fucking idiot! This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Like the one I'm cuddling? You know, tadpoles are not evil. Sometimes they just need some hugs. Ah, he's smiling! I'm hoping for a last grave cure. I'll do the best I can. I'm no master Halson mind. He'd have your tadpole out like that. Still, we have options. All right. Let's see what we can do. Okay. What is this plant? Will it help? I have a fluffy bunny, so if I died, you know, he would have nobody to take care of him. And I also have this taxidermy hamster. No, it's plushy hamster that would also miss me very much. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? Hmm. Well... Looking closer, you realize you've seen this thorn in the wilds. It's Kalimvor's kiss. A briar from the Dale Lands. And a deadly poison. <gasps> Put the briar down and we'll talk. Yeah, we might need to find help in Mikoshi. If we go to Mikoshi, maybe the parasite will leave our heads. What's this? I came to you for help. I want to help you. But I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? Anita like the Valor spoke to me as if I were one, one of its own. This is basically a suicidal line. But I kind of want to say that. I made friends with an intellect devourer. It recognized you as being infected. Well now, that's something. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. On a mind flayer ship. It was filled with sexy mind flayers. With long tentacles. It was a great time. I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. Do you guess you're dangerous? But you seem like a good soul. Ah. You deserve a chance to save yourself. Ah. Thank you. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Does Lazo want to lick my pussy if I say I swear? I think she already wants to do that, right? I swear! I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never Yummy. once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. 
There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Nobody ever told me that. You must have... You must have learned something from studying them. For one... I love that Dungeons and Dragons like too. Nothing we've ever seen from you see this friends. dice? It's, it's one very heavy. For sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet. Anyhow. Your, your subscription goes directly to support Blackjack and Hookers for my fluffy bunny. The name of my bunny is Boo. He's a miniature giant space rabbit, cousin of the hamster Boo. So thank you. Enjoy your bunny mouth. Sadder than myself. Uh, you said you were tracking the other victims. Did they change? Hard to say. He's there's off. a lot we don't know. Infected. Folks like you have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. Thank you, when Master Halston heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Oh. So, go and get him! I've sent birds to find him. Birds. But the place is rotten with goblins. Found you from and if my birds can't get close, then, and I'm still what chance do I have? Thank you. You, though. You're one of them. Technically speaking, Thank I mean, you, JJ. they won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Yeah, I have to draw the new ones. I, I have a few ideas. There is one that's almost done. I'm just having some trouble because I didn't draw for a long time. We didn't unlock emotes for many years and suddenly we unlocked eight emotes. But I'll, 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 get, I'll get the hang of it. I'll try to draw, draw some more. And when my bunny's around, I have a camera that you guys can see him. But as you can see, he's not there. So, but when he's, he's around, uh, I'll show you guys how fluffy he is. All right, I'll find Halston. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you what happened out there. But those adventurers were the only witnesses. Lua lost And they're it? long gone. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Step at a time, Nettie. Come on. Nah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say that. You guys will think I'm weird. There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. Was he supposed to be talking to me right now? Breathe quiet. Move with care. Out of sight, out of mind. Then Nika. Best be on my way. Oh my god. Your friends keep pitching Baldur's Gate to you? You came to the wrong place, my friend. Because there is no way you leave this stream without start playing this game. I have played this game for over a thousand hours. I love this game more than anyone else. I thought you were Halsey. The boar prances around, haunches clenching and unclenching impatiently. <laughs> Where's Halsey? Promise me a mate. You see? The boar is horny. Now, he's out horny, shaking his bits on the stairs, and Halsey is nowhere to be seen to bring this boar a mate. It's fucked up. I don't know. 
<laughs> Darko. Ah, my good friend. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? Yeah? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Oh, yeah? You love it more? I love it more. I have a Mind Flayer boyfriend. I have one collector's edition. And I have a second collector's edition. And I have a Mind Flayer parasite. And I have a bear costume. Dressed as a mind flare in an airport, and I didn't get arrested. Don't ask. Fine, ask your questions. Glory. Now then, how would you describe <clears throat> that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Yeah, the, the collector's editions are expensive now. When, when I bought mine, they were just the normal price, okay? Because they were actually for sale for six months. They sold out the day that Larian showed that this game had bear sex, okay? So, so... I thought this game was worth the collector's edition before I saw that this game had bear sex. You guys waited until you saw that this game had bear sex and then you thought, oh, maybe I should get the collector's edition then. I don't blame you. Bear sex was awesome. I never saw it before. I got you watch it live. I was actually in the audience. So if you guys go down my Twitter three months ago, one month before the release of Baldur's Gate, I was dressed up as a mind flayer in the airport because I was flying to Belgium to be part of the, l the last panel from hell because Larian invited me and I was so happy. So you see this mind flayer? This mind flare is actually uh, a lab skeleton that I dressed up on my mind flare outfit. So I was dressed like this. I swear that those are not the bones of my ex boyfriend. So I was wearing that on an on, or an air airport. So if you guys go in chat and use the command bear sacks. Right after the bear has sex with the vampire, there's a girl that goes, oh, That's me. Goblins? Hardly. They were shape shift devils. Ye gods! Can it be? How terribly compelling. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Well? It was brass, no doubt about it. Witness mistook obvious silver dragon for brass. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yeah, they were like, absolute, absolute, absolute. They did, didn't they? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, curious, oh, curious indeed. Mm. I've interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! <gasps> Never you mind. 
I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. Wait, about our conversation earlier, why the dragon? My friend, every story benefits from a dragon. Until we meet again. It's true. I smell drama amongst these in Just a moment. This man is recording my story. I am far from home. As the colorful man starts scribbling, the bear sneaks a quick look at the page. His brow furrows. Incomprehensible squiggles surround a crude sketch. A bear disemboweling a clutch of tieflings. Oh, that's not so friendly. Volo is great. Slow down, what's wrong? Can't you hear it? Her singing. It's awful. Terrible. Um. Moon. Sun. No. <laughs> You're killing us. My head is melting. I'm leaving before the damage is permanent. Dance upon the stars tonight Smile when pain will fade away Words of mine will change No Become uh. What's that tune you're singing? More like butchering don't know why I bother. The animals agreed. Why do you think they left? Uh, I thought they were cheering me on. Uh, even animals think I'm terrible. I want to finish this song, but I can't. Nothing fits, you know? Let me see if I can help. Hmm. It can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. First things first. What's the song about? My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Her two left feet mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her. Dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble like ash. Wait. Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. Words of mine will turn to ash when you call the last light down.
Ah, this is so pretty. I love this so much. was beautiful. Worthy of you, tears. <laughs> Thanks. That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. I, I can still smell it. Well, you you have came up with a fine tribute to her. Lihala said that's why eulogies were important. They were for the living as well as the dead. I'd forgotten what it was like. That itch to perfect a song. The Weeping Dawn will be my gift to Lihala. I've a long way to go. But thank you. I, I needed this. Too sweet, odiously sweet. The vomitous gall within despairs at your kindness. On the stars tonight, smile and pain will fade away. Words of mine will turn to ash when you call Don't give me trouble now. Nah. We are still. What level are we? If everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. What level are we? Do you guys think we can do the harpy fight solo? We're still level two, right? Oh, we're almost level three. Let's try. We're almost level three. Maybe if we discover this. Singing? Did that give us XP? No. Oh, I have an idea. I think there's a secret chest nearby that we can pick and we'll level up. And then we'll fight the harpies. I love the harpy song as well. That's why I wanted to go there. I have the high ground, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Very well. Yeah, but I don't know if I can but level up a while back, in the cutscene. His smell is gone. He's gone. No. This poor sad bear. What are you looking for? Master! He left with the weaponed two legs. He said he'd be back. But I can smell them, the weaponed ones. And I cannot smell him. He's not coming back. No. Don't worry. He will be back. No. The woods have gone dark. 
There's too many predators lately, even for Master. Oh. I wish I could give this bear a big hug. That's a friendly looking shadow. I know. Oh, uh, uh, I kind of wish we could adopt every animal and have like a zoo in our camp. Oh. Well, we do have an arrow of teletransportation. Transportation. Murmur. You know. You know, Noel. Murmur is the reason why. Yes, I see. I decided to play this game today. Remember yesterday when we were playing Alien Isolation? And. Uh, And I got really scared. Thinking of Murmur made me feel better. Oh, I fell? Dang it. Yeah. So... Thinking of Murmur made me so happy. I got scared playing Sky again. Can you believe that? Such a pretty song. Nope, no level. Shit. We need like a, a fort of experience. Where can I get a fort of experience? Oh, I know. I smell. Adventurers, what have you heard? Oh, I can use the shovel? Okay. Oh, yeah! We completed Arabella's quest. They're right here. I should speak up. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little Hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. Aww. Hope we'll meet again under better circumstances and you two will not be dead. Likewise. Arabella? Thank you. For helping me. You're welcome. <laughs> Haba! Nice. Oh, we got a beast companion. Boo. Squeak. We got a uh, level one spell. We can replace the spell and we can sub uh, a subclass. Yeah. 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 We'll go Gloomstalker. And... Uh, other spells are pretty bad. Cure Wounds? Can I make Cure Wounds that bird? The heart bird? There's a boo mod? No, no. Gloomstalker. What's a good AoE? Thorns? Yeah. Let's try healing. River Crawl. See you soon. Thank you so much for being here.
Let me just try the healing. Core wounds in the burb. Yeah, so some companions they are okay if you a devil child. One if you sleep from us. with some people. Savannah, I just want my bed. Take cure of the bird's eyes are glassy. It's breathing weak. Your chest tightens. Your fingertips shake. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Yes, yes, yes. Go, go sir. Yes, it's true. No murder. Uh, do you guys think lesser restoration works? Any word on Master Halson? No. Yeah, some people don't share. Because if lesser restoration works, I could. I could put it, but. But I would need to respect. Because I don't have. Dalclane, Eldritch Blast works against you too. Keep their confidence, if you insist. The Amulet of Sylvanas? No, no. Store spouse lots? No, right? I hope we can do this. This is gonna be hard. Such a pretty song. Shh. Listen. Your favorite drownings will take place in shallow water. No, we are alone. Just a slice of the ankle tendons. Melody plays above the waves, beckoning you, drowning out all logical thought. Uh oh. Struggle against the music spool. Okay. You okay? High five! Woo! Thank goodness! The suffocating yearning suddenly <laughs> fades oh my as goodness. the spell breaks. Dying You're often! Free. Thank you so, so much for your two months of support! I'm sorry I didn't see your subscription before. Thank you, dying often. I too die often. Not in real life. Get back, it's a trick! No, no. It's just a bit of water. I only want to listen. Just a little closer. Oh no. Boobs! Yes, everything's gonna be fine once I get there. No, no! No, no! This is fine. This is an action, right? Mm. 
No, it's a bonus action. Oh, it's free? It's just free. Can we restart this? I think instead of talking to the boy, I'll position myself higher. And then we can do this. Damn it, Miller. Such a pretty song. The bot is refusing to say. How do you catch a bra with a booby trap? Miller, that was pretty good. I feel really bad that the bot refused to say. Thank you so, so much for the 23 months of support. Thank you. I actually find that bras are very useful for multiple things. Like you can use a bra to hold things. Like sometimes you don't have pockets, you can put your phone in your bra. And it stays there. So... Just keep that in mind. Hold on. Who's Nika? Oh, but I can't see them. Oh shit, I can't see them. Very true. It's true, Cauliflower, you see? Such a pretty song. Shit. It's okay. Please. I feel like this is gonna be really hard. Before I talk with the boy, I'll take a speed potion. No, 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 pickpock the boy. <laughs> okay, I will skip. Don't you hear it? It's so peaceful. No. Yes, everything. Okay, this is fine. Because now we have. Uh, Oh, we lost a turn talking to the boy. But that's okay. We have a long strider. Do you guys think it's a good idea? For me to come here and push this harpy off. I could push it off. And then shoot the others. Or I could do is come here, attack this harpy. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna do enough damage. I, I could hunt a mark on somebody. Probably on the harpy that's luring the boy. Because I feel like shooting from here, I'm not going to do any damage. Don't waste a step. It's fine. But I had the low ground and everything. Yeah, now should be better. Go well, Hunter marks that. And I will shoot. Why does it vintage? Oh, because I'm threatened. Shit. 
was still good. Not bad. High five! Then we can attack this one. That's bad. <laughs> That's good. I can't let the kid die. I can't let the kid die. Thanks. You see? I'm allergic to children dying! Thank you. Such a pretty song. I want to have a word. Wait. I didn't know... I didn't know they would target him. Apparently they do. Melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. The suffocating yearning sudden. Yes. Did I lose one round? I did. It's okay. I'll actually go up, but I'll go up here. So we have advantage. I can't walk. Why? How? No, it's fine. Now that I'm down here, this is fine. It's okay. Run. I have an idea. I could use an error of many targets. Do you think they're close enough? Shit. Ah! This is awful. This is okay. They the kid is alive. I'm dead. Okay, this is gonna be hard. But I think we can do this. I, I just need to be smarter. Uh, I need to get the high ground. Hold on. Such a pretty song. I don't have any scrolls. I don't have much. That's the problem. I can drink a potion of flying. You will really need to draw any Help. attention. Hey. It's amazing how long I've been watching you stream, but I have no regrets. Love you all. Oh my gosh. Avi's heart. Thank you so, so much for the 64 months of support. Thank you. Mm. 69 months is gonna be the best. We're gonna make a big party. You, we are so close. Thank you. Thank you for supporting Boo for 64 months. <laughs> He's so cute. Boo, your fans, they have been asking, Boo, for cow Boo. Do you mind? He 
he hates hats. <laughs> Nelza, thank you so much. Thank you for the 23 months. Thank you. Thank you, Nelza. Okay. Now we have the inspiration to kill the harpies. So make sure that Boo is safe. Howdy, partner. <laughs> Yeah, he's free Rome. That's why that sometimes I don't have the camera. It's because he, he is whatever he wants to be. So he's free to go. Uh, my house is bunny proof. So he gets to be safe and go whatever he wants. Wait, sorry. I'll make Boo a tad bit smaller. Okay. Such a pretty song. Um. No. Okay. Hopefully, we'll get three turns now. Your favorite drownings will take place in shallow. A sweet melody plays above okay. the waves, beckoning. Nice. High five. Drowning out all the suffocating yearning suddenly fades. As the spell breaks. No. It's a trick. Yes. Hold on. No, we still lost a turn. But now we can fly. We can probably push this one that's super high off the cliff. Do you guys wanna try? I don't know if it's gonna work. Hold on. Oh, we can't. We can't fly that far. We can fly here, though. But the problem is, if we fly there... It's likely... No, I think we'll be okay. Okay. We attack them? It's okay. It's okay. Run, kid. We should be fine. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Run, 
the kid! Run! Okay, the kid is fine. Okay. Now... One six damage. We can probably kill this. <laughs> Panic. Okay, this is fine. I will be lethargic the next turn. So I need to bail. I should probably disengage? And fly off. Or I could take an attack of opportunity, which is not good. What do you guys think is best? To waste an action disengaging or we just attack? The problem is... We'll be sitting here... Two turns for the harpies to attack us. And there is no way I can kill one of them. What I could do... Is also risk an attack of opportunity from this harpy. I think we need to disengage. Where is the best place to hide? Probably. Probably here. See ya! We can actually go further. We just need to run. We're only level 3. It's taking the long... I thought the kid was far enough. I I I thought the kid was far enough. Pretty song. Yeah. I was too good at disengaging. Unlike the kid. Maybe I should really throw the kid away. Please. This is possible though. A sweet melody plays above the waves, beckoning you. Okay. Drown the suffocating yearning sudden. No. Yes. Okay. I'm lured. This is the worst timeline so far. Uh, we will both just die.
can't get invisibility for the kid because the only person selling visibility potion I used on my mom. A pretty song. I think the best I can do is not use a speed potion. I'll just go raw. Your favorite drownings or a sweet melody played above the waves, beckoning you. Drown a suffocating yearning. Su no. Yes. Okay, we saved. Will Hunter's Mark? And we'll shoot. God, this is bad. I actually had a good idea. My God, you guys, he sleep. You guys, he sleep. Such a pretty song. Oh, we let him sleep. Ah, oh. hold on. Um, here. I will drink. Can't slow down. I'll drink this potion of fly. Then I'll talk to the skin. Your favorite drownings will take place. Don't you hear it? It's so not Yes. Okay. Now I'll take this speed potion and I'll throw at the kid and me. Because now the kid is hastened and he can run much further. Uh, okay. So. I'll actually go here. Nice. Nice. It's okay. We just gotta survive this. As long as they shoot me and not the kid, it's fine. It's okay. idea though i think it works the kid just needs to run the kid just needs to run uh fairly okay can anyone get the short maybe we should have a command of that hold on can't risk the Okay, we're going to go even harder this time. I'll use an oil of diminution in the weapon that I will use to attack. Do I have any other oils? I do. This wyvern toxin. I use this oil. I use the potion. I use the oil. I'll talk to the kid. I'll save, so I don't need to redo this every time. A sweet melody plays above the waves, beckoning you. 
drown Here we out. go. All the suffocating yearning suddenly fades. No. Yes. Yeah, the kid is the last one to act. But that's okay. We'll do the same thing. I feel like I'm too close to the kid. No, this is fine. Nice. Um... Shut up. It's also silenced. I should have used Hunter's Mark, but I forgot. It's okay. I think I'll not use it for now. No, I kind of need to. It's the only way I can kill it. right here in front of the kid and hopefully they target me Drink? And we attack. Should we? No, we can't Hunter's Mark. I could. I could go up. So I have the higher ground. Because then I have better chances hitting them. I think actually arrow of many targets might be good there. I think I might be able to hit all three of them. Nice. It was a low row, but it's okay. I should probably Need go here. Way forward. <laughs> oh no. I hope they hit me. I feel like if they hit me, I might be out of the con out of the luring song. Come on! No! Yes, I saved. High five. Okay. Next turn, I'll be. I could throw this harpy on that harpy and hope they get prone. Fuck. 
No i jej. This is bad. I need to try again. Yeet! Nice! It's prone! High five! Okay, so... I could do this! Off balance? I just don't think that will be enough. I could drink another haste potion. So I'm not lethargic the next turn, but... No, no, the kid's not dead. is dead. No. Okay. Damn it! We'll try again. We can do this. Box of Bento, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I, I, I had another idea. That's okay. It was a good try, though. It was shitty that they went for the kid. Your favorite drownings will take. Don't you hear it? It's... A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. The suffocating yearning sudden. No. Yes. Love all the Thank you, Blizzard. Thank you. Thank you. Me too. Okay. I love them too. Thank you so, so much for mwah, the two months of support. Thank you. Yeet! Okay. I can't get there anymore, right? <laughs> I can. Yeet! <laughs> That's bullshit. How you mean? Yeet! <laughs> okay. Two birds with one bird. High five! Hold on. Oh, it's too heavy. I don't think I can push it anyway. So, what I can do is apply this oil to my weapon and hope for the best. Throw the kid away. Oh, did I forget to use the free attack? I forgot. It was my bad. Your favorite drownings will take place in shock. Don't you hear it? A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with I got magic. This. The suffocating yearning sudden. Yes. Yeet! 
Okay, good. Yeet! We attack. I need to go closer. I can go closer. Come on, game. Let me go closer. Good. Hopefully they'll come for me. Hold on. Hey, Bento! What's the Bento thing? Does this kid des deserve this? Why are they going for the kid? I might need to stay near the kid. Oh, it's because I, I did break the concentration, right? Vento, enjoy your bunny emotes. All your support goes to blackjack and hookers to this fluffy boy. Your Thank you, Vento. drownings all take place in shallow water. Just a slice of... Don't you hear it? A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A heartbeat's charm. Can I? The suffocating yearning suddenly fa No. Yes. The kid has one initiative. I can't believe this. I might need to... Sixty-five percent. I I I need to go close. It's the only way they don't attack the kid. Seventy-five percent. Why do I even bother? <laughs> and it also saved the concentration. Well, let's see what happens. If the kids survive, it's okay. Thank God. Yeet! Okay. I'll 
go lethargic. He will also go lethargic. I will need to throw another haste potion at both of us. It's the only way. Or the kid can't even run. No, this is fine. I'll just heal. Now get the fuck out of here, kid. God. I need to disengage. <laughs> Fly. Hold on. I'll drink the haste potion. I could grease them and hope all three of them go prone. It's probably my best bet. Only one. Don't go for the kid, don't go for the kid, don't go for the kid. Don't... Yeah. It's okay. I should have had stayed.
I think it will not opportunity attack me, right? Or will it? No, I don't think it will. Yeah, I, the reason why I yeeted is just so I wouldn't get opportunity attack. I think I need to go back to Troll Barbarian. Oh, it couldn't act. God. The kid is suicidal. Okay. 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 There is no way we can kill this though. We do have... Uh, the poison. God, and I wasted both of my things and... Oh, this was awful. Yeah, it will opportunity... Pray. <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. Will I get opportunity attacked if I attack this? I will. No, I will not. Okay. Minus one harpy. Can I eat it? Hold on. I will need to throw this harpy at that harpy. Nice. Do I go near the kid? To protect it? But I only have 6 HP. Yeah, I forgot to... I, I know I need to heal, I just didn't get the chance. So here's the thing. Do we go near the harpy to protect the kid? Yeah, right? Because if the kid dies, we need to reload. Healing was worthless. Heal. Healing was worthless. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! It's okay. We got this. We got this. So close. I think I need to kill one of them right Shelf right away. Drownings will take. Don't you hear it? A sweet melody. It's the only way. Above the waves beckoning, drowning out the suffocating yearning suddenly fade. No. Yes. Hold on. 
The problem is, I couldn't kill that, and the kid walked in. Everything that could go wrong in that fight went. The kid's still lured, right? Let's Hunter's Mark. 65%, that's the problem. It's just too little. <sighs> 85. Not bad. Okay, good. Run, kid. I'll need to go back down, or they will attack the kid. But I had to go up so I had higher chances to shoot. Oh, mom! <laughs> yeah, this fight is this fight is tough, but it's okay. It's the dice. It's the dice. God. Your favorite drowning. Don't you hear it? A sweet melody plays above the waves. Beckon. No. I'm not giving drowning this up. The suffocating I'm saving this kid. Yes. Good. We can actually kill. Do I have... Uh, do I have any other arrows? Let me see. No. more damage with my Tron Javelin than just shooting because I have the high ground. The Javelin doesn't wait a lot, but I have high ground. I think I'll do more damage throwing. I was wrong. What it's okay, but at least it broke the concentration of the harpy. I should have put my my melee weapon. It's okay. Oh no. Oh no, the kid will get opportunity attack, right? No. He did a dash and a disengage. That's the smart kid. High five. It's okay. Okay. Okay, we can kill one of these... Can I fly? No. I 
I think I'm better off just attacking. Okay, let me walk here. Nice, nice, let's go, high five. That was great. And the poison broke its concentration. High five, let's go. Okay. to protect the kid. Oh no, lethargic. It's okay. It's okay. too far oh this is so bad it's okay i think the kid the kid is far enough now it will probably try to fight to fight to us it's okay let me go a bit closer it's fine It's actually good that it's concentrating because it's singing. Oops. Oh my god. It's fine! It's fine! Hazav! Okay, this is probably going to be the hardest fight in the game. How did the kid come all the way here? First try! I love this. I wish every fight was this hard. Yeah. Uh, are they gone? Yes, they are gone. Are you alright? No. Tell me, Mike. Thank you so much for a prime subscription. Thank you. Thank you. I know Raphael. Raphael was a lot easier than this. <laughs> Take a breath. Deep and slow, you're safe now. Th that's what the voice said. <laughs> I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get back. Mo will be so mad. Aww. Wait, um, you should meet Mo. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donnie. It's gonna be fine. We just Tell need some him levels. To see the dragon's lair. Oh, we've been there. Zombie Mike, thank you so much. May the bunnies be with you. 
I can probably one shot Raphael if I if I do things right. We'll see. It's okay. It's okay. Honor mode. We, we basically completed honor mode already. We did the entire game on Tactician without reloading a single time. And if I died, I had to delete my save file, in which I had to do once. <laughs> so that was our last playthrough. Oh yeah, I forgot the chest. So we kind of did our own uh, home-based honor mode. Oh, fancy. Zombie, so thank you so, so much. Mwah, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the five sub gifts. All your support goes to... Blood Jack and Hookers. For that boy that's about to lay down. He's like... You called me? You called me? You called me? You called me? Are we clean? Are we clean? Nah, he just likes to lay down there. Zombie, thank you, thank you. I think he's gonna lay down soon. Thank you, zombie. Thank you so much. No, Clark, he, he has his bathroom. Boo is very well potty trained. The only chance that sometimes I find one poop that's not in his potty is because sometimes when he's dreaming, it comes out. But I can't blame him, you know? He's just a baby. He's just a baby. Thank you, Z Zombie Mike. Mwah, thank you. He's sleep. <laughs> I know, you know. It's literally the only... It's the only way. I got the chest. I, I, I think there was something else here. Wasn't there? Oh, no. Oh, yeah, there is. You hate when you do that. He's very cute. Let's see what those harpies were hoarding. I mean, uh, right now we have nothing, right? I even equipped this magic ring. My might bring me some some good luck. <laughs> Who is fucking harpies to make? It? Probably the harpies are fucking themselves, right? How do harpies reprodu reproduce? <laughs> I mean, I didn't study harpy reproduction while I was... Is the nest? I think the nest is here, right? Yeah, I want a serious answer. I don't know about harpy reproduction. Can I find that in the player's handbook? Hypnotize men? Oh god. Are you serious? What to do? Polish dagger. Oh shit. I'll ask my ex. She just had a kid. Hmm. <laughs> 
It's messed up, yes. dude. Yes, I see. And just that with two hours or one. <laughs> God. Okay. There's another fight here that should be a lot easier. Ah. We didn't have a long rest yet, so. <laughs> I'm sleeping. Oh my god. Trail fish next to the elevator. Huh? What's that? I think they forgot about the fish and just fell asleep. at your foot and bites it. Calm down. I'm a friend. You barged in without an invitation. I wouldn't call that friendly. See, you're in my territory and I want you gone. All right, you win. I'm leaving. I better not catch you round here again. It's their territory. Imagine you somebody barging to your house. You would be upset too. Yeah, no. I'm not kicking a squirrel. You're crazy. You're crazy. That's a friendly looking shadow. Best be on my way. I think he's surprised. I gotta do this. Bush! Yes! Oh, I was expecting further. Oh well, whatever. Shoot! Ooh! Did I heal? She helped. Not much, but she helped. Telling me I can push further? Oh no, not anymore. Shit. Still worth it though. Is it though? One six damage, six eleven. I think we just kill. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> oh god, she hit him for zero. We kill. <laughs> Panic! Panic! <laughs> Panic! A five! You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone poorly. Yeah, but with you're zero not here damage. For heroics, are you? Avernus's stench <sighs> is all over your skin. Let me guess. 
Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. Mm. Too bad. I earned it, fair and square. I've been to Avernus, but I'm no devil servant. Care to explain why you reek of the hells? I'm sorry, I was fighting some harpies and they made me sweat a lot. I'll take a shower. <laughs> Soon as we're done talking. <laughs> um, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. Considering what I've seen, you'd be surprised. But if you're not here for the coin, I'd rather enjoy the quiet. There's not much of it anywhere else. A mind flare abducted me. And its ship went straight to Avernus. She believes! Have fun! Well, that's quite the story. And I thought I was doomed. Now I feel sorry for you. <laughs> Thank Here. you. Take this. It's worth a fortune. But a fortune's not worth much if you're dead. Consider it payment Aww. for saving my life. Thank you. What exactly is this coin? It's a soul wrapped up in a terrible iron package. Don't ask who's because I don't know. <laughs> I hope it brings you better Probably luck than it has the me. soul of one of you guys in chat. You guys, you know what's crazy? I've been streaming for almost eight hours. And I didn't notice. <laughs> I love this game so much. <laughs> I love this game so, so much. You peer through the telescope. Squint? What do you guys rather do? Squint or, or focus the telescope? Perception, right? Maybe. Oh, they're both perception. Okay, let's focus. Woo! High five! You see a red dragon. High five! Tyrannical, greedy, and vain. They hunt without pity. Um, NDAs, I've never tried playing this game. Move the telescope. Uh, it, it went to the left, right? The telescope points to the left. I never played this game on a PlayStation, but I've heard it's really good. Okay, just dead people. The telescope points straight ahead. So... I, I've, I've, I've known a lot of people playing this on the PlayStation and loving it. And I also know some people that play Delarian's previous game, Divinity Original Sin 2, on a freaking Switch, I think? It was also something like absurd with a controller and they loved it. And they thought it was weird that I was playing it on a computer. So... The telescope points to the left. They, they do make it work. Oh, did I point to the wrong place? Guys, I I might be able to do the lots of things right, but I can ahead. never tell between right and left. When I was a kid, I used to write with the left hand, but because writing with the left hand is so much more work, my grandfather taught me right. how to write with the right hand and I wasn't supposed to use the left hand. And, and it just got my head really confused, okay? If you ask me, left or right, I'm like... God knows. <laughs> yes, I did kill Millennium on Dance Pad. In fact, I did all of Dark Souls 3 with a level 1 character on a Dance Pad. Including the DLC. All, all of that is on my YouTube channel. Yeah. I also played Bloodborne on a Dance Pad. I played Elden Ring with a drawing tablet. 
I played Elden Ring with motion controls. I actually made motion controls work on Elden Ring with the help of a bunch of friends, of course. And killed Millennia with motion controls as well. It was really hard. But I can't tell between left or right. Or west. Uh, this is a solo run, but I'm using a different build. I'm going as a ranger. I'm try- uh, right now I don't have the ability to, but I- I want to try to do many fights as we can in one turn and see how that goes. How is this game of a controller? I've heard it's really good. I've heard it's really good, I never tried it, but I've seen lots of people play it and they love it. So, if you guys want to see all that... Dark Souls 3 with a level 1 character and a dance pad. Elden Ring with a dance pad. Elden Ring with motion controls. Elden Ring with during Me doing a bunch of Baldur's Gate challenge runs, like completing the entire game with one character, completing the entire game without reloading, a bunch of Baldur's Gate 3 shorts, uh, Bloodborne on a dance pad, your mother on a dance pad. It's out of my ear. Except the last one. That one your mom didn't let me upload in. People up ahead. Something's wrong. I'm low health. I'll feel that one later. You're a true soul. You can't die. Please, stay with us. I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? <laughs> you, not a step closer. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your lithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Oh, panic. Freeze and hold up your hands? I've never seen that before. Be a healer, Bry. She might be a bandit. Wait. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brenna. New recruits. Yours to shepherd. Protect them. She is a true soul. Mind her. She will. She. She. Awesome. Thank you, Killer. Thank you. Edwin. Ed. Please. He's with the Absolute now. You're. You're a true soul. Edwin, our brother. He was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Um... I actually want to kill them. Do they die if I send them to the Albert? I don't want the Albert to die. <laughs> Chris, we are we are the mini Mintara. That's why our name is Mini Tara. Leave? 
Explain this absolute to me. What? Are you... Are you testing us? The absolute is our goddess. Oh. She's going to rip down the old world order, start a new one. Oh. Then we'll be the ones with the power. Well, oh. you will firstly, true soul. You don't need me to explain that. A true soul, like you, has been chosen by the absolute. You speak with her voice, and when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. You're mistaking him. I'm no true soul. Yeah, fuck that. What? What are you doing? Your sword brother, now! You spoke of the absolute. Same as that goblin, Zaza. Curious. Can I blind him? I never used the spell before. I'm using it. Okay, he blind. And I go. And uh, can I jump to the high ground? I mean, not enough space. Run! Ah! Gosh, I'm so tiny. <laughs> Ow! Wow, that's rude. I think I'm dead. I think he's dead. Yeah. High five! Well... Now they're out together. We're united. Whew. That was a wild ride. <sighs> yeah, that blind was awful. I, 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 I learned I'll never use the spell again. Strange power <laughs> resonates within the corpse. Comes to you. You're only level Most three. Corpses feel like toys before you, to be played with and discarded when you tire. This body seems different. A friend calls out from the corpse, desperate Aww. to be freed. A Why friend? let its host's memories go to waste? The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Hello! I am a friend! Ain't I cute? Come talk with me! Come on, guys! Come talk with me! Embrace the desire to commute with me. <laughs> Good job. Oh. Hi. It's me. I'm famous. Thanks, guys. Now I'm free. Cool. Thank you. I know you meant the tadpole, but thank you. Sex?
With Lazel? Speak. I think we can have sex with her. I think we just need to flirt with her a little bit. Is it me or you have been looking at me differently? I have a confession. I was too hasty to judge you. I thought you witless, gutless, unimpressively bland. And what about now? Now? Well, you've earned my respect and more still. You've proven your wits. You are efficient and dominant, in and out of battle. You've proven your courage. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon to plunge into another. And you're hardly bland. Your scent alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hair stand on end. The attraction is mutual, Basil. You know how to set my heart racing. Good. I want to taste you. Perhaps tonight. Perhaps later. But I want it all the same. Do you? Yes. I want to share my body with you. Come on, you guys! The second is so much better! Really? <laughs> sure thing, I've been wanting a hot gift yankee girlfriend that goes like check all the time. Come on, fine. But I really want a hot girlfriend. And it's not like we ever had sex before. I won't be your girlfriend, but I will be your lay. Yes or no? I love how direct she is, you know? She's like, wanna bang? Yes or no? <laughs> yes! Yes. <laughs> Perhaps one night soon, I will come to your bunk and take what is mine. Until that night comes, I shall keep enjoying your scent. <laughs> I think we're in, friends. I think we're in. <laughs> Wait, before we rest, we have one potion of animal speaking. What's up a discussion? Keep moving, stranger. I think Quietly. she likes us. What is that? I told, I told you, you to, to go. go. I don't have the spell speak with animals. I didn't pick it. So we need to respect perception. Five! You see a name etched into the leather. Scratch. You're a scratch, aren't you? Come here. It's all right. You know my name. Interesting. The predator wouldn't care to learn it. 
Still, you should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. I don't think he's going to wake up. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. Come on, you can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave him. If he doesn't wake up, follow my scent. I have a cap. If it comes to that, I may. Thank you. Good boy. Good boy. Such a good boy. He's the goodest boy. Friends, it's getting it's getting late. <laughs> we can stop playing. I know. I know it's really sad, but gotta stop at some point. When I'm dead? Of hunger and sleep deprivation because I just wanted to play Baldur's Gate? Hey, no. Good luck. Do you guys want to try end the day and see if Lazo comes? Shack for us in bed? I mean, on a sad note... I'm so glad I found... Wait, it's me! It's Elfira! From the Grove! I think we can save her. At the ready. Hold on. Let's go to her. Hold on. Hold on. No, no, it's fine. What's fine? It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Nothing is wrong. Everything is right. Everything is absolutely right. I just wanted sex, not murder. Oh man, no, we let her die. You guys, this is my fourth playthrough of the game and I never seen Alfira alive. <laughs> I never had a place where she survived, you guys. You know... <laughs> never! My, my, what manner of place is this? <laughs> what the fuck is happening? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? What the fuck? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps? The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? Well met, 
I am Raphael. Very much at your service. It's not every day one meets such a cavalier sinner as yourself. A true bloody pleasure. Raphael, I'm sorry, I was on my way to get laid, and you're interrupting that. Walk away while you have legs to walk with. Ugh. It looks like a deep gnome, but it speaks like a beast. Must be the surroundings. Rather bleak and lonesome, one feels so exposed. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my <laughs> Thank tests. you, Alex. Come. There, middle of somewhere. The music. Reach for my weapon. Tart, tart. No need for that crew. Go for the ice bowl. Go for the ice. As you can see, yum, 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 yum. I'm amply provisioned. This is the House of Hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. I'm like so attracted to Raphael, but after learning that he lasts less than a second in bed, I am so not attracted to Raphael anymore. Let's just ignore him and get some food. I'm hungry. <laughs> not easily rattled, I see. Good. Makes the next part that much more straightforward. We don't have a... It's true, Mango. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? <laughs> Potentially. An adversary. Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. <laughs> My, aren't you a nervous one? I assure you I'm here to help, not harm. Consider your predicament. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Oh, yeah? Go for the balls, boo. Go for the balls. Yum, 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 yum. You're mad if you think I'll make a deal with a devil. And what is madness but a denial of reality? Still, I have a feeling you'll change your mind yeah. before it's changed for you. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. You must gather door. your party and venture forth. Hope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Such a tease. Thank you. Thank you, Snake. Ooh, may the bunnies be here. You know, I, I, I kind of wish the tadpole was a romanceable option. Mm. I'll rip out your mocking tongue, devil. Ah, yes, the tongue. 
Yet another piece of pleasurable anatomy you'll soon have to do without. All those Eurasian, thank pretty you. little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. God, I love him. I love his voice. I especially love that he gives us free food. Your violence is. Did I say it? Fuck. <sighs> out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> Your actions are. Oh no, this is bad. <laughs> this is bad. This is bad. Oh god. Oh, it's okay. I just skip. I just skip. Yeah, yeah, she's gonna be pissed off. At least she's gonna be alive. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Moving ahead. Hold on. Yeah, we are playing a Dark Urge run right now. It was not that far back. It, it's just Raphael. But I can just skip the cutscene because we just watched it. It's okay. Every run is a Dark Urge run. <laughs> You're not wrong. How is Raphael in the middle of the grove? I just wanted to have sex with Lazo. Yep. It's not every day one meets such a cavalier. I'll keep the I'll pick the same things. Uh, middle of it might. Am I afraid? Potentially. I could fix it all. Like hope. <laughs> Easy. Have fun. What the fuck? Did they fix this? <sighs> I couldn't because she was healing. I did say first. I'm Dale. Thank you so much for the four months of support. Ooh, thank you. Thank you. Non-lethally shove her off the cliff. What I can do is your violent. Should 
you can't heal, it's okay. Your violence is drawing the Sorry. Friendly faces. Well met. Goblins roughed me up and stole my hose when they heard me singing Hatchling Love. <laughs> you wouldn't have half a bedroll for a lost minstrel, would you? I can pay for my board with music. If you care for it. <gasps> oh shit! Isn't this isn't this the the Dragonborn Bard in Act 3 near Near the hottest woman in Baldur's Gate, Nine Fingers. No? Who the fuck are you? Quill Grootslang. Soon to be published in the songbook affairs in ancient Abir, Songs of Draconic Love. <laughs> uh, if I make it to Baldur's Gate with my manuscript, that is. <laughs> it's dangerous out there to be traveling on your own. <sighs> I know. It's not the first time I've been robbed. I am only glad I didn't get hurt. Our heart is open, and there is safety beside it. I'll just stay one night. Promise. Then I'll be gone. I know I'm ice blood, but I, I get cold so fast. I need to be by the fire. She's so cute. Oh, she's just so cute. Why is she in her underwear? She doesn't even have pants! Right. Time to skulk about. <laughs> oh, she got robbed and they robbed her pants? Yeah, it's very safe. Don't worry, you guys. Our camp is safe. Everything is fine. You open your eyes with a lurch. And you are not in your bed. You stand above a body which is in a state of gore nearly beyond recognition. The body of that scared girl who asked for nothing more than a night of shelter. Her blood covers you. And its warmth feels like the embrace of an old friend. You recall nothing of how you ended up here, but your head pounds and aches. I'm too stupid uh, to do anything. Try hard to remember something, anything. The throbbing in your skull will hardly let you think, let alone remember. Investigate your surroundings. An explanation!
there is nothing else here and no one else around. <laughs> you and the corpse seem to have been alone together for quite some time. No matter how it appears, the body is there and her blood is on your hands. The question flows through your mind. Who are you really? That you could be guilty of such bitter business. Do you guys think Gil and Lisa will still want to sleep with me? <laughs> I'm not getting laid! <laughs> A little, huh? I'm kind of curious. If you could craft a corpse like this in one night, what masterpieces have you sculpted in your forgotten decades? You don't have much time for reflection now. You need to act. You may only have a few moments before the others awaken and begin to cast blame for the hot sin before you. Stealth? Stealth! When stealing from from your companions bites you in the ass. A five. A light and delicate girl. There should be no trouble at all to toss her into a ditch. You roll her away, further bloodying your hands as you do. In lumbering style, you have gotten away with murder. You see, I was eating a sandwich last night. I'm pretty sure they have... Move oh, Pat again. I'm pretty sure they have ketchup in Baldur's Gate, right? So, so my, my sandwich, since it's round, it, it, it fell from my hands and it rolled in a perfect circle. And as I was trying to catch it, it, it started dodging. That's why there's those splash... Splasher of blood. I mean, ketchup all over the place. I swear. I am not trying to romance the dog! Need to find a way forward. I know the dog has standards! Nobody wants to talk with me? It actually worked? This devil, Raphael, flaunts his paltry wings as if he wants to impress us. You saw the red dragon slaying his infernal kin above hell's fires, did you not? Next to a dragon, the devil's a gnat. 
When I am Kithrak, I will take my Queen Vlakith his head as a trophy. Well, we have no dragons at our disposal now, I'm afraid. I will sit astride one. It is only a matter of time. I will ride a red dragon. I will wield the silver sword. And I will conquer every layer of hell, should my queen command it. You know... I really feel like creating a character. That's a dragonborn, that's red. But somehow his... Penis is silver. So I can say, I can be your dragon, you can wield my silver sword! <sighs> you know? Have a good night, you guys! We'll stop here! Mwah! I'll see you guys tomorrow! <laughs> Think of cute bunnies, okay? <laughs> Mwah! Bye! Stay safe! Don't let don't let the dark urge bite. Mwah. Check out my YouTube and my my Instagram and uh, oh oh that's that my bunny's not there. Mwah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I hope you guys had a good time. Thank you so much. By the way, we'll keep playing Baldur's Gate, but we'll mix Baldur's Gate with some Spider-Man, some alien isolation. We'll we'll have fun. <laughs> We'll have a lot of fun. Uh, I will I will send you guys to a ve very wholesome friend of mine. She's like my tween. Except she's the evil version. Because she's fully wholesome. So, so don't tell her I'm kind of weird. Have a good night. Thank you so much for being here. Mwah. No, we're, we finished Cyberpunk. We'll definitely go back at some point to Cyberpunk, but... It's gonna be in a while. You guys... This is the best dice I have ever seen in my life. We'll roll it one more time? Ah! Here. Look how heavy this dice is. Hold on. You could kill somebody with this dice. It's fully metallic. It it came in the uh, collector's edition of Baldur's Gate. If you throw this at somebody, it's a weapon. <laughs> Bye. It's nice. 